Roach Clip Podcast. The Roach Clip Podcast. The Roach Clip Podcast. Roach Clip Podcast. Roach Clip Podcast. Roach Clip Podcast. The Roach Clip Podcast. The Roach Clip Podcast. The Roach Clip Podcast. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to the Roach Clip motherfucking podcast. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you just say Roach Clip? I we know, haven't bro. even started fucking drinking yet. <laughs> this puto's already drunk. <laughs> <laughs> it took him like two hours to get here. Uh, yeah, the traffic. He has a urethra problem. He's always pissing his pants. <laughs> hey, was it hey. Last? hey, hold on. What episode are we on? I think it's 22. Episode 22. I yeah, think episode so. 22. Is it? You sure? Brought to you by the fucking Cactus Cannabis, Cannabis Magazine. Yeah, we had the fucking owner on last week. Big Titty Mike. Big Titty Mike on the ones and twos, you know what I mean? He was spitting his knowledge about the cannabis industry here in Phoenix, Arizona. He comes all the way from Texas. Hey, I want to let everybody know out there that when Big Titty Mike was being interviewed last week or the week before, whenever it was, right? Hey, he wanted us to call him Magic Mike, and we did out of respect. But those days are over. The respect is done? The, is that what I'm hearing from Choice? After, after that episode was over, I was like, nah, with the with this guy's tits, because he has some nice tits. I ain't going to lie You either. couldn't even focus, right? <laughs> I couldn't even focus. If you notice, the last episode, you didn't even hear my voice that much. You didn't focus. Because I just kept focusing on his tetas. Well, well, he was talking. He was doing most of the talking. Me, you were doing most of the jerking. <laughs> yeah. Did you see all the fucking saliva I hit my chest? Fool? Yeah, fool. I, I couldn't take it You anymore. filled out two fucking cans, this <laughs> Nah, but check this out, fool. I want to ask you a question. This Does is, it have anything to do with the current situation in Syria? No, it's about Yemen. All right, go Nah, ahead. have you seen fucking Cali lately, though? It looks like fucking Yemen. Yeah. Goddamn, this fool posted a video on online. Uh-huh. And this fool just fucking cruising down the freeway. And it just looks like the fucking apocalypse, bro. Bro, it's all on fire? Fire. It looks like fucking CGI. Hey, what's CGI even stand for? It's a tell illiterate Mexican like me what that means, that's it. I really don't know what the fuck. Hey, fool, I could just see your mustache over the mic. It's <laughs> like it's so beautiful. I know. No, I really don't know what it means. Hey, for, I'm fucking hey audience, I know you guys can't see this fucking idiot, but he's yeah. wearing a fucking shirt with his own photo on it. <laughs> and it says, Food City, Chorizo, one ninety nine a pound. Yeah, but dog, I don't know, fool. They said today was a no fire day. I still turned on the fucking bonfire. Yeah. Is it hey, bonfire? They said no fire day, but we're still podcasting this. Hey, yes, it. Yeah. <laughs> you never know, dog. We might start a forest fire here. Uh-huh. We have, a, we have a fucking special guest in the house. We got fucking Santa's little helper. She misses her fucking friend Monster. Hey, yeah. before we never found Monster, carnal. Yeah, that's sad, bro. Rest in peace, carnalito. I can see him in the stars. This brought uh, Chorizo's drinking a barrio, a blondie. A barrio blondie. Ayo. Hey, so what's up? Before we start, before I hit record, you said you've been having a fucked up day or fucked up week. Hey, so wait, wait a minute. You're hey. not recording this? Yeah, we're recording right now. Oh, but you said before I hit record. <laughs> hey, I got a question, though. Huh. So the other day I was going to pick you up, remember, and give you a ride to AutoZone? Yeah. You were walking. You fucking yeah. say, hey, carnal, can you come pick me up? Because mm-hmm. my real friends ain't answering their phones. I said, you know what, dog? I'll drop everything for my podcast partner. I won't call him <laughs> a friend. He's just my co-host. You know what I mean? Hey, when, you're other, when your real friends don't want to hang out with you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so you called me back not to pick you up. So what happened, bro? I was just wondering. Oh, because I needed a part, and then I ended up getting it, like, sooner than I thought. So I was like, oh, shit, well, I don't need Victor. So you jog- I don't need Tolo to give me a ride. You jogged to fucking AutoZone, or somebody ended up picking so, you up? Somebody ended up swooping me up. And then, uh, so I just went back, and then after, uh, when I got there, it took me, like, less than five minutes to fix the problem. And that was it? You yeah. You were crying over all that shit. All that shit, bro. But so, it's because I didn't have the part. And what, like, what part was it? It was, uh, okay, the AC. So, hold on. You were dri- uh-huh. you were driving your truck? I was driving my truck, and I and heard, like, And then just a, fucking shut off? No, I started smelling, like, like uh, the smell of burning rubber. So, you started, was, you started to check your calzones? <laughs> yeah, so I started thinking, well, maybe my shit's rubbing against my pantalones, right? Yeah, and it's creating that friction. Yeah, because I like to wear a rubber, bro, because it decreases the sensation. Yeah, if I wear a rubber when I go to strip clubs, I put yeah. a little bit of whipped cream inside. <laughs> and then when you get a, when you get a hard on and the high nut, and the high nut's dancing on you, yeah, oh, just you boom. bust you, oh, you could bust three solids. That's it. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, Your fool. fucking Connor looks like a fucking cheese stick hey, by fool. the time you hey, fool. No it. joke. Before I ever fucking, before I ever got laid or anything, uh-huh. I fucking jacked off with the condom on just to see fucking. 
what it felt like. Hey, for you know how amazing it's, it was. It it's horrible. No, it made clean up a lot. No, now we. No, it makes clean up a lot like easier, easier. But it's just it feels like, weird. Yeah, when you're like, because you feel the rubber in your hand instead of your pito. Yeah, and that's no good. Dog. But even when you're banging with a rubber on, it's weird. Yeah, but I ca- I kind of like it because you feel like a fucking champ. You f- you start yeah. off with it just to make sure you don't fucking end the game soon. Yeah. And then once you're fucking, once she fucking got off, you take it off, is it? Because you know you're going to fucking last three, four more pumps. Yeah. Because they call this about the two-pump chump. I don't know, bro. I'm, I'm on medication. I can last all night. What kind? Oh, I don't even, I don't even want to get into this <laughs> yeah. medical history. Yeah, you don't hey, have dude, to get into it. Dude, that I got to punch my wevels just a nut, bro. I opened his medicine cabinet, dog. It looked like fucking Willy Wonka in the chocolate factory in <laughs> that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I'm like that yeah, fucking you, giraffe from fucking Madagascar. Yeah, yellow pills, purple pills, green pills. Upper downers, pill. all arounders. All I had it all. Hey, salud, carnal. I got the daybreaker. You guys already yeah. know this fucking podcast is brought to you by all right it's brought to you by two fucking alcoholics okay so 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 your truck broke down at your destination like you you smelt the rubber did it fucking not start again or what that's it no i I smelt the rubber and then i was like what the fuck is that and then i heard like a real loud like bang banging and grinding and so i just parked it in a parking lot of some dealership so I acted like I was going to buy a car. Oh, shit. Though. Hey, sir, we can't fuck it. We don't yeah. trade in fucking yonke. <laughs> they were like, hey, get that piece of shit out of here. We're losing customers. Hey, Holmes, pick up parts <laughs> over there, eh? <laughs> they were like, hey, free tow right back to your house, puto. So what ended up happening is I go inside, and they have, like, this tray of fucking chocolate donuts. And I just sat down and started eating donuts. Like, at the fucking dealer? Yeah, at the dealer. Like, I fucking went there to just, like, pick somebody up or no, I'm waiting fuck, on something. No, Geraldo Rivera's fucking <laughs> brother's going to buy a car. <laughs> <laughs> They're all calling the media and shit. <laughs> <laughs> there are people walking up to me taking selfies. And then so your whip just fucking crashes out at the fucking So while I'm sitting there, I'm thinking, of, yeah, so I'm sitting there and I'm just thinking, shit, I need to get this shit fixed. So I called somebody to come get me. This was in the morning. Okay, this was like 7.30 in the morning. Damn, you broke down that fucking early? early yeah. That's the worst, dude. Yeah, when I mean, it's all why, early. Why don't I break down like at noon, you know, when my yeah. body's ready? Yeah, yeah, fucking yeah. Nice. I wasn't ready for it at I had all. a couple fucking cafecitos, mm-hmm. a monstro, two jaladas. <laughs> then I'm ready to fucking work, yes, Yeah, it? you know what I mean? Once I'm done fucking spitting, I'm legit. Because you cannot fucking work. You can't do any kind of work without jacking off before it's in. Yeah. You have to, fool. You know what? Jacking off is like having a cigarette after a good meal, bro. It just feels better. It does feel better. It makes everything better. It makes life better. You know, if you know you got to go to work and you're like a construction worker, you got to shoot off a couple of loads, you'll fucking run all, all, oh, all day fuck fucking yeah. with two by fours on your back. Two you by fours shit. on your back with fucking <laughs> combat boots on. You're running yeah. like you got Nike running shoes on and shit. Yeah, I'm telling you, bro. Okay, so your truck breaks down. So, so my truck breaks down. Hey, hold on. One more thing. Fuck the audience. That's it. Yeah, fuck the audience. All right, cool. I hate them all. Me too, fool. Hey, send in some donations. My partner Chorizo needs a new fucking whip. <laughs> like, fuck, that fool has like six cars and they all break down. That's it. He just alternates. Hey, his. one of my fucking cars couldn't make one car. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, he just fixes the one that needs the fucking cheapest part at the time. <laughs> like, right now, this one just needs a battery. Yeah, so that I'm, other one needs a windshield. Windshield. The other one needs fucking a banda. The other one needs a fucking trunk. If it was a banda, he puts on the fucking El Recodo, starts fucking dancing. Homes. I put on the fucking banda machos. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> um, so I ended up calling somebody to come get me. And I just left the truck A there. professional or like a friend? Nah, just a friend. I just said, hey. Like a, a real, real friend? friend. <laughs> <laughs> I just said, hey, uh, this is what happened. And then this fool's like, well, I'm going to go get you. Like, I didn't even ask him to come get me. That's good. That's a real friend. Yeah. That's what real friends do. That's that's a real friend. So he said, hey, I'm just going to go get you. I said, fuck it. Well, come get me. I'm not going to argue with that. You know what I mean? And I just left the truck there. I didn't give a fuck. So he's like, well, what's wrong with it? Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Let me back rewind, it up real quick. Rewind. Rewind. Mira, Chicano U-turn. Let's rewind. Chicano Mira. U-turn. <laughs> Throw out the pinche window. It's your puppy shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> so when I get there, it's smelling like fucking burnt rubber. I park it. I pop the hood. And, you, and the fucking serpentine belt, it just fucking busts. Like, it almost hits me, bro, because I'm looking at the engine. And it just busted, like, bah! It busts with no rubber. Yeah, <laughs> so I was like, fuck, it's just a belt, but it's no biggie, right? Yeah, I'll go to AutoZone. I fucking, get in the zone with AutoZone. I got a fucking 1962 Chevy Love. Yeah, I'll just tell them straight up. Yeah. 
So I told him, hey, I need a belt. And they're like, hey, well, my, what size hey, are my, you? My uncle used to have a Chevy Love and TJ. Yeah, a little truck. Yeah. One, one time we fucking. <laughs> that four woke you guys up were in, fucking in the truck? That fool woke up in the morning <laughs> all fucking pissed, bro. <laughs> Somebody had rolled it down the hill, fool. It are you serious? Over, yeah, it was over there on the wall of a fucking, of the tiendita. It and it just, pissed. it was all smashed? Yeah, some kids just fucking Did drove it? by and put that shit on neutral. Because <laughs> <laughs> he lived on the top of the hill, bro. <laughs> that's classic, right? Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. All right, so your homie says, hey, S.C., don't even ask me, S.C. He got you on GPS tracker. He's fucking there before you know well, it. All my friends have like a... This vato puts on the bat signal. All my friends have a little map on their phone of where I might break down. See more. So the, the closest one is so they tell you straight up, I'm on 39th Avenue of Bethany, S.C., where, <laughs> where are you broken down now, you know? No, what happens is after I look at the strip and T-bone, it busts. I'm like, all right, it ain't no biggie. I'll just buy another one and then put it back on. So this person picks me up. I end up going to fucking work. And then um, I was there for a little bit. This was on the weekend. I was there for a little bit. and you, it, was, you, it was left over the weekend? No, it was on the weekend. Oh, it happened on the weekend? Yeah, I got it. I was able to get it. Because everything that, whenever something bad happens to me, it's always during the week. That's it. Yeah. Well, you it could have I mean? been during the week. I don't know. I'm fucking... You're retarded. I don't care. I'm <laughs> okay, so your homie picks you up. So then you I go get the I, serpentine belt. No, I had somebody else get it for me. So you just hey, pick that shit hey, up. Hey, pick for that me. shit up for me. I don't yeah, got time for that. Yeah, I so got then, time for that. Then later on, I got fucking taekwondo class. <laughs> so later, I'm about to get my yellow belt. Yeah. So I ended up just going home, bro, and and to fucking uh, watch to you know to watch a novela. <laughs> no, I didn't even. Not even that. I was just sitting there watching. You know, I watched the TV for like eight hours, and I got real bored. So then I ended up just turning it on. And I said, fuck it, I'll watch a movie now. And you just said, forget about well, it. Well, because the whole time it wasn't on. Oh, you're just watching. I was just sitting there watching. You're watching it. the black box? <laughs> Remember black boxes back in the day? Yeah, hell yeah. Hey, man. dude, my cousin used to have one. Oh, for real? And fucking, there was a, there was a family party. Mm -hmm. So my cousin lived right across the street from my tia's house here in Phoenix. Yeah. Like on 35th Ave over there somewhere. Where, on Van Buren? Van Buren, somewhere. It, no, no, it's like 15th Ave. In like Van Buren. One of them, yeah. The one by no, the, no, no, no. It is 15th Ave. Okay, you know where By Rose, the Chinese restaurant? There's Roosevelt. There's a little Mexican restaurant that's been there since the fucking 70s probably. Yeah, right next to the boxing gym. So there's a fuck, And then, well, that fool fucking, they lived in one of those little streets right there. Okay, do you remember there used to be a little Chinese spot right there? On 15th oh, Avenue? Oh, yeah. And, okay. It's not there no more? No. But check this out real quick. No, we'll get back to it. Go ahead and finish what you had to say. Fuck, what was I talking about? You were talking about you were at your tia's house and she was making tamales. Oh, and yeah, then, yeah, yeah. Okay, go ahead. So then it was going back to the black box. <laughs> <laughs> so it was like a family party. Everybody's across the street. Dude, the whole family Everybody's dancing, partying. snorting fucking Coca. Minas, whatever, dog. <laughs> smoking fucking smoking gallos. Smoking piedra. Huh. So everybody's Stealing over there. Stealing from all, each other's cars. All the adults over there fucking doing their thing. How hey, how long ago was this? This was, uh, if I had to guess, probably like 1997, bro. All so, right. So, Brody was fucking little. I was even smaller in the pantalones. So, then, fuck, everybody's partying across the street. We go to my cousin, fucking Gordo's house. Yeah. And they had the black box, fool. Is he, it, was he Gordo? Yeah, he was chubby, fool. He had, oh. like, nice, cute little cheeks. Uh, you were, uh, like, yeah. squeezing him. He kind of looked like Squidward when he shaves his head. He yeah. has three fucking brains. That's it. <laughs> That motherfucker's smart as fuck. Is he really? <laughs> <laughs> fucking three brains, Holmes. <laughs> that fool could use them at any given time. Uh, hey, don't that make motherfuckers are Jeopardy and shit. Don't make him use all three, fool. That uh, fool, yeah, when we used to play video games, he's better than all of us on our games. We're like, yeah, because this motherfucker got three brains. He hacks into the juego uh, that before fool it was, even comes out. That fool's all telling Alex Trebek, I'll <laughs> take a Lotus for 300, sir. <laughs> yeah, so we go, to that fool, we go to that fool's house, dog. It's me, Prodi, my cousin Gordo, and then another cousin fucking sees Little Caesar. And we're all fucking watching the Spice Channel fucking. <laughs> oh, you guys are fucking nasty, bro. Loud and clear, it's just so fucking. Uh, you naked? Fuck, I wish, it's <laughs> it. <laughs> and we're all just like staring at each other like while watching the porn. Like, I'm staring at you right now. I'm like, hey, guys, I got to go take a shit. You know what that fucking <laughs> meant. <laughs> so I went and fucking rubbed that one. Means fucking I was rubbing one now and these fools kept knocking on the door and oh! shit. Oh, I hate when they do that. But I didn't give a fuck, homie. I fucking busted all over the fucking tissue, eh? For real, yeah, dog. But they knew what you were doing, huh? They of were course, like, come on, because you were in there for at least two minutes. At least, dude, two minutes. Yeah, and that was a good, solid fucking chump. Yeah, I still remember we were watching some hyenas in the back of a truck, like washing a car and shit. Yeah, but that was fun. That was hey, a, what's up? What time I stayed at a 
fucking shitty ass hotel in Van Buren, right? And you ordered the fucking Oh, they had, like, the Chinese porn and shit. Oh, they had, like, you know how they have, like, those shitty porn yeah, stations? Yeah, you put it in, it's, like, just a videotape, huh? Like, the fool in the front puts on, and he fucking streams it to all the <laughs> to Channel 3 and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, wait a minute. This one was, like, real fucking fuzzy, right? Because I only watched it one this one time. And I, at the end of this story, you'll know why I didn't watch it again. All right. So, it was real fuzzy, and I can't make out what's going on. I'm like, okay, it's two people, <laughs> it's two people fucking in back of a U-Haul. Oh, like the it was it was the U-Haul was open and then they're just fucking. So I'm like trying to like mess with the antenna because you know back then the antennas are all fucking weird and you had to like move them around in order to get some reception. Yeah, it wasn't like digital fucking TV nowadays. It's, yeah, these kids are fucking spoiled. Bro. Oh, they're real spoiled. That's a story for another day. I think. <laughs> so I'm like fucking with the antenna trying to get this picture right so I can see what's going on because I just I see two people banging, and this this fool is hitting their fucking doggy like going bananas. What what color people were they? If you uh, could remember. White. Both of them? Yeah. That's crazy, huh? White porn stars have big dicks, that's it. <laughs> well, check this out. After I got the fucking, the antenna, like, give me a better picture, it was two vatos. <laughs> <laughs> it was, was yeah, really? it was two vatos, bro. That <laughs> motherfucker was fucking the shit out of the other one. And I was like, oh, my God, I got all fucking weird out. And I turned it off, bro. How I long like, did you watch it for? Well, I was, because I was trying to fix, well, maybe, what? like, all together. Hey, but what? Fucking Maybe like five minutes because I kept trying to fuck was with it. Was it on like, mute or fucking? Yeah, it was on mute. Oh, it right, was on mute. Fucking, you would have heard two fucking vodkas <laughs> yeah, going. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, no, uh, it was on mute because uh, it was uh, on mute. Uh, I didn't want anybody to know I was looking at it. You know what I mean? Well, yeah, everybody watches porn on mute. Yeah, so. It's pointless, <laughs> it's pointless to put volume on fucking porn. Porno, yeah. Because everybody, hey, I'm going to go take a And you got to remember, back People, then. You start fucking Googling shit. Some fine high night comes on. You're like, fuck, yeah. I'm, I'm in here by myself. And back then, the pornos had music. It's not like now where everybody oh, just everybody fuck. just starts fucking. Right now they just fuck. Back then it was there was a soundtrack. You don't know if you wanted to buy it. You know what I mean? Hey, can you I fucking can wanted you? to buy the bootleg at the perros. But <laughs> that's why you kept the volume down. You know what I mean? It wasn't like now where you want to hear her voice and like I want to hear her fucking blow fucking hey, smoke fool. out of her ass. There's these fucking there's these fucking videos. They ain't even these high nights ain't even fucking boning, bro. They're just talking. Uh huh. They're, they're naked. No, but they talk with this fucking. I forgot what they call these videos, bro. What do you mean? And I don't know, fool. They just fucking. They're called podcasts. Uh, they, get, <laughs> <laughs> they get you. They get the hand. The hand motion going, bro. What? What do you mean? Wait a minute. I bro. forgot what they call them, but they. But are they talking dirty? Yeah, like like whispering and shit, dude. Yo, fucking throwing some headphones. <laughs> yeah, like yeah. they're like, yeah, that's what I want. No, they'll just, yeah, they'll be talking anything, but that girl has, like, the best voice ever, you know? And it's all sexy. Oh, dude, she's like, yeah, tonight. Tonight I want you to. We're going to get the robes. Yeah. And I'm going to take your robe off. <laughs> I'm going to slide my finger down your back. Huh? I'm going to grab your taco. Until I get. Until I feel your cheese. From your butt cheeks. And I'm going to squeeze. Is there a name for that type? I forget. Yeah, there is. I forgot what it's called, but I, I fucking listened to a couple because there's this video. There's this website I go on. Yeah. Boxing.com is just like a fucking bunch of message boards and shit. Yeah. Kind of like the Rogan board. And they just fucking post cool shit on there. And some fool's like, hey, bro, like, no joke. These these bitches are on YouTube. Yeah. They're like, hey, I dare you motherfuckers to watch this and not fucking bust one. That's it. And I what happened? Pff, I fucking failed the challenge. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, so but then again, I bust to anything for him. So what happened? You guys started watching the spice. Uh, was there more to that story? No, I just jacked off while these fools were bothering me, dude. Oh, okay. And then I just that was my only. Co- well, that fool was like my only cousin with money. Yeah. So these fools had a black box and all this shit. Oh yeah, you always have that one cousin, cousin who just had a little every- fucking more than yeah, you. Yeah, that fucking sack of sack shit. Sack of shit. So, oh, so yeah. check this out. And when I talk about my cousin who had a little more than me, I, I'm talking, talking about, about his dick size. <laughs> <laughs> like, this vato was look like a caballo. Anywho, remember that oh, the, the little Chinese spot that was right there on 15th Avenue? Oh, you know yeah, yeah. talking about? Okay. On I, Van Buren, right? I knew. No, no, no not the one on Van Buren. This one is closer to uh, Roosevelt. Oh, like on the. Yeah, on yeah, the, yeah, yeah. I know, like facing towards like where Buster's is at. You know where Buster's is at? No. Oh, never mind. Okay, I know. I kind of know what you're talking about, but yeah. keep going. Okay, well, I knew the owners. Were they Chinese? Yeah, they were Chinese. But this is a crazy thing about it was. Don't bring your dogs around those pools. <laughs> yeah. No, the crazy thing about it is that the owner, he loved to get fucked up every day, bro. While his wife ran the cash register. What did he drink, sake? Nah, he drank some shit. It was yellow. It was like in a in a 
It's called Mialo, like a whiskey bottle. Mialos de chorizo. <laughs> it was called camel piss. And well, he, and he drink that shit all the time. Well, when I go over there to get food, like my girl will be talking to his wife because she ran the register, and then she's like. She won't want to ever charge us for anything, but we tell her, no, it takes the money, take the money. And she's like, no, 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 no. So they take oh, the money. Take the money. Yeah. Man. So they take the money, but they give us twice as much food. Okay. So they give us like bags and bags of shit, bro. But there was a another thing that I had to go with that was I had to sit in the back with the husband and get fucked up. How's that bad? Or because the thing? wife didn't want the husband getting fucked up, and my old lady didn't want me getting fucked up. Oh, and you two borrachos. Oh, we're just in the back getting fucked or drinking, bro, at a little table. It's like having fucking AA with two yeah. degenerates. And then he had all these, he had a few Mexicanos cooking the food. You know what I mean? Hey. So it wasn't really Chinese food. It was like Chinese hey, Mexican at this, food. <laughs> at this point, fool, at this point, Chinese food ain't even Chinese food. food. It's Mexican. All, yeah, it's cooked by Mexicans. <laughs> yeah. I even see fucking Mexican fucking sushi chefs all the time at the fucking restaurant. Like, what's up, S.A.? <laughs> he has a bandana with the fucking, <laughs> with the red dot in the, in the fucking middle. His name's Chino. He's from fucking 21st He's Street. From fu- <laughs> His name's Chino. He's from Chino Hills, California. Uh-oh. He was arrested and fucking did three years in Chino. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what ends up happening one time? Well, I'll only drink Bud Weiser, um, Bud Light or Budweiser with them, and he drink that yellow shit in hey, a fucking lie, bottle. Fool, you're old man. You drink Bud Light now, Holmes. <laughs> so, what ended up happening is one day, one day I asked them, I go, "Hey, let me drink some of that, you know, some of that shit you're drinking." That yellow fucking. And then he drink. goes, he started laughing. He's like, "You're not ready for this. You're too young." I'm in my twenties. You're too young for this. And I go, no, let me just have some. So he gets a styrofoam cup. I thought you were old your whole life. That's <laughs> I was born with a fucking with a silver big, spoon in my mouth. You were born with a fucking bigotón <laughs> so, in your mouth. <laughs> so he gets a little styrofoam cup. And he half of it, he fills it up with water. And then he puts like a little bit, like a shot of that shit he's drinking. Oh, and he just drinks it with water? No, he. that's how he served it to me. Oh, Konawa, he watered yeah. it down. Like he watered it down like a motherfucker. And I go, man, what the fuck's this? And he's like, don't worry. Just try it first. And then if you want more, I'll give you more. Chorizo's hand. Uh-huh. Chorizo's so, hand. So I tried it, bro. Chorizo's hand. You take the wisdom I give you. You drink <laughs> with water. <laughs> the water is so, within you. The earth, the earth is 90% water. So I got to give you 90% water. You fucking stupid <laughs> fool. So after I drink the water, uh, <laughs> he gives me this fucking little styrofoam cup. I fucking try to slam it, and I'm on fucking fire, bro. My chest is fucking burning. And it's mixed with fucking water. water. Like most of it was water now because it was, you know, he you know filled it up halfway. Bro, I was in fucking agony. I was like, I couldn't breathe. He won't stop laughing. And he's like, I told you, you're not ready for this. I told you. You're not ready, young yeah. man. You're not ready. You will never snatch the grasshopper from my hand. You're you no know? good at wax on, but you're <laughs> great at wax off. <laughs> so that's the last time I drank with that fool. That's when I realized he was a G. He was and I was a- just the fucking guppy in a pond with big fish, bro, because it was fucking crazy. You know what's crazy about Chinos? What's that? They drink every fucking day, and they smoke like three packs of cigarettes a oh, day. Oh, yeah, and they live and to they be live 100. To like 300, <laughs> yeah. Fool. Yeah, I know. You I know went why? to this Chino's. It's all that fucking ginger and rice they eat, is it? Ginger, rice, fish. Fish. Fucking fish. Uh, sushi. Fish. 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 And sushi. And fish. <laughs> <laughs> hey, fool, how'd that fool drink it? Just Oh, he just took it to the head. He'll just take shots or like he'd have no, like he would just, with it and sip he just on sip, it? He was just sipping on the bottle while he was sitting there talking oh, to me. Oh, shit, that's a real G. Dude. Yeah, he was just... He was doing it like Big Titty Mike was on the last last podcast. Just straight to that. the fucking... Oh, straight yeah, to Big the Titty dome. Mike with yeah. the fucking whiskey. Yeah. Hey, we and we got kept, a bottle here. I said, come pick yeah. it up, Holmes. And the, is his bottle still here? Yeah, his bottle's still here, but I ain't trying to drink that shit. That's yeah. Shit. I ain't Irish. Do you know the name of that bottle? It was called Expanded Nipples. Hey, didn't that fool kind of look like Howard the Duck, though? Big Titty Ooh, Mike. Big Titty Mike. He has that Howard face. Remember uh, Howard the Duck? Did you yeah. ever watch that movie? <laughs> yeah, that movie was dumb. That shit was dumb, fool. I just remember the Playboy <laughs> fucking with the duck tits. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. He yeah, throws yeah. on the toilet or yeah, something. Yeah, 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 the duck tits, yeah. And his, his fucking house blows up. <laughs> Does that fool get sent what, to Weren't they like aliens or some shit? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hey, so fucking, I got a... Doo-doo-doo, doo-doo-doo. I got a fucking update on the rape scandal. You know, oh, who right, Al, what happened? you know who Al Roker is? Yeah. That motherfucker quit the Senate. 
because there's pictures of him like they went they went to some show in Afghanistan or some shit. And he was raping some girl from Afghanistan. Nah, one of the hyenas that was with them. He was fu- raping. She her? crashed out, and this fool fucking took a photo grabbing her tetas. Why the fuck would you do that? Yeah, so he just fucking pretty much snitches. And right now everything's coming. That happened like in 2012, but right now's the time to snitch on somebody that I mean, this happened like 14 decades ago. But um, I feel I still feel violated. Because you see, with Time Magazine, they were they did the Person of the Years, all the high knots that came out in snitch. Are you serious? Yeah, they're all on the cover. I said. <laughs> are you serious? Yeah, and then some fools are trying to post a video now of fucking. Chris Rock grabbing some uh, Reese Witherspoon or one of these fucking young hyenas ass. Okay, you're telling me you won't grab Re- Re- Reese Witherspoon's ass? Not because she don't have one. I'll be grabbing That's her back, saying. homie. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, girl, you got more ass on your back than you do on your ass. Baby got back. Uh-huh. L.A. face with okay, Oakland so, booty. <laughs> so why was your day so fucked up? We still haven't got to that, is it? Or do you want to just fucking not talk about it? Oh, no, let's, it? Not, let's finish talking about the carro. The oh, truck. Yeah. Okay, so oh yeah, where were we at with fuck the car, like, bro? I know, fool. I'm all we over a, the place. Hey, I'm all over the I place. Haven't, I haven't, Stop guys, busting, fool. You're all over the place. You guys got to <laughs> understand. I haven't seen Chorizo for over 18 hours. So yeah, we haven't seen each other in a while. A lot of shit happens between when me and this four aren't together. Hell yeah. And uh, okay, I'll tell you what happened. So the throat guy. Hey, I, tell the hey, tell the audience what's going on. Really, we have a, the paparazzi here. <laughs> there, we have a paparazzi <laughs> taking pictures. We got all kinds of beer and mota. <laughs> on the mesa <laughs> All kinds of If they fucking raided this house right now You know we're fucked right We're fucked Full would be like <laughs> Getting fucking impounded well, What do they call that When they throw humans in the cage uh, The hole Going to prison or whatever Yeah But fuck it dude That's where we belong yes, Oh man it's chilly hey, out here Talking ain't about it? that Hey some fools in prison Started their own show homes what do you mean, like a <laughs> podcast? Uh, yeah, on Facebook. Uh-huh. Uh, and they have high nuts fucking asking questions, sending photos in. See, bro. See, and how they, the fuck you, they get that? And I, I don't, you, we, we don't get that. We could get like fucking, we don't even get like two listeners, fool. Uh-huh. And these fucking fools in prison just fucking running games. All our fucking real they're, friends won't hey, even subscribe. They're all reading <laughs> ads and shit. This is that, this, bro, this ad's brought to you by 1 800 Bell's Bond. <laughs> this I this was uh, uh this odds brought to you by Top Ramen Noodles. The the shrimp is on sale right now at Fry's. You get ten for a dollar. Ten for a dollar. Okay, yeah, so fucking let's go back to the troca fool because okay. I keep forgetting to come back so, to that truck because that truck is really important in our lives because you got yeah. on episode one you talked about picking. And I still have truck. that fucking truck. Let everybody know I hey, paid five hundred bucks for that piece of shit. Check this out for the audience. I'm gonna drop one classic episode. A month for you motherfuckers on yeah, SoundCloud that'd be nice. and iTunes. Yeah, that'd be nice. So this week, I'm going to drop episode one. Yeah. So you guys can go back and just listen to the Reminisce. beginning of this beautiful fucking podcast. How did it all start? How fucking Chorizo entered the Tolo fucking friend zone. <laughs> We're not even friends. I'm not, re- not real friends. I'm not, even, I'm not even in the friend zone with this. <laughs> all right, so back to the troca. Back to the drawing board. So then I had somebody bring me the part. Um. Oh, no, no, no Okay. What happened was, later on, I went back, got the part, and then I tried putting the new belt on, but... But your dumbass but, couldn't do it? No, I, we, we ended up doing it, but what happened was, the AC compressor went out, so that pulley didn't work. Oh, so the... Comp- yeah, that shit just... It was false. stand still? Yeah. So... So then the whole... The, the whole fucking belt started, like... Move. The whole belt, the belt started... Making oh. noise again, and then it was it started like burning rubber. So that's probably what fucked up your belt yeah, in the first in place. Yeah, in the first huh? place. Come on, dude. You know. Start using this. Start boy. using this and less of and this. Stop using this. Yes. <laughs> so what ended up happening was um, I said, okay, I'll just eliminate the, the, f- the AC. Because com- who needs AC in Arizona? Ain't nobody needs an AC, bro. Fucking. Bro, if you fucking have air conditioning in your car in Arizona. You're a fucking lever. Yeah. You know what I mean? You're a piece of shit, bro. You are real you're... fucking G sweat their ass off in a 125 degree weather. Please donate to the podcast. My <laughs> my buddy needs a fucking AC in his troca. <laughs> he has like three months to fucking get one. Please help us out. Yeah. Hey, you know what's hey, crazy? Hey, you send us ten dollars, we'll send you a fucking camisa that says <laughs> "fuck you." We'll send you a camisa that says "Roach Clip Podcast" with a picture of my truck on it, and then the back says "fuck the audience." <laughs> yeah, fuck the audience. Well, um, anywho, hey, you know what the crazy thing is about that truck, bro? I bought it for 500 bucks right over a year ago. It's still running. And if it fucked up right now like that, I couldn't even use it. 
I could still sell it for five hundred bucks. Oh yeah, because every I'll fucking buy it off you for five hundred. <laughs> <isn't it? laughs> I know that's a, that's the funniest thing to me in the world. I'm like, those fucking rims cost five hundred bucks. Dude, I'll you know? be like, hey, ¿cuánto quieres por la troquita? Oh, esta pinche troquita corre bien bonito. Why do they call they call it troquita all the time? Huh? And then they yeah. go like that. Yeah. Pinche troquita, <laughs> yeah, they're like, we're not. They fucking start pointing at it and shit. They, they're pointing at the stars while they're fucking telling you how, yeah, how tall it is. This fool fucking brings his son's fucking power wheel. <laughs> is this troquita enough for you? Oh, this is troquita. Oh, okay. Um, so I ended up finding out that I could buy a smaller belt if you don't have an AC to bypass compressor. bypass the AC compressor. Yeah. So I got the smaller belt, which was a pain in the fucking ass. I ended up getting it. I'm standing there putting it on, and it's like... Maybe like a half an inch shorter than the original. And I'm like, how the fuck is it that? That don't make no sense. So now it's on there and it's all loose. I go, this don't make any fucking sense. Like, why the fuck would they sell me this belt? This belt doesn't even fucking fit. It's too big. It's just almost as big as the original one. For real? Yeah. So they gave you the wrong one. So I was like, (sighs) so I had to do some research. Who was behind the computer? A Mexican? (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, that's why, fool. So you know Mexicans just fucking cheat right. their way through what, through <laughs> whatever. whatever. Yeah. Hey, you know how to fucking drive a forklift? Yeah. Fuck yeah Hell dude. yeah, I'll drive that motherfucker. Yeah. Hey, but I've fool, been driving you know, forklifts for like five or six seconds. Hey, you know how to fucking cut some carne? <laughs> Fuck yeah. yeah. You know you know how, know you know how to cook some cabeza? Uh, you know how to give some cabeza? You know how to Even pull better. on some carne? <laughs> 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 all right, so fucking. So what I found out was this: after all the bullshit, there's a. It's called the. Uh, it's called the uh, fuck. I forgot what it's called. The rotator cuff. <laughs> no, it's another pulley that you put in place of the compressor, and then just so it could spin. Yeah, it just spins. It's like a wheel. Yeah. So you take the AC out, and you put that little wheel, and you put this wheel right there, and it bolts on with two bolts. Oh, so you had to go buy the wheel later. Yeah. So later on, and then I had somebody bring me the wheel. I was impatient, so I took off walking because I was pissed off. And then hey, sometimes you just gotta get pissed off. Ooh. Yeah. To make shit happen. Yeah, because you know I mean? if you don't want these fucking queers or just fucking <laughs> look at you like yeah. you're a retard. <laughs> They're going to be staring at you while you're standing out there. Hey, well, Everybody's what? passing by going, Everything's what is this Koto doing? Everything's fun in games till somebody gets pissed off. That yeah. shit really happens. Fool. Yeah, tr- shit goes down. For real, though. No, so I'm just standing out there in, uh, in the parking lot. You got fucking security guards. All these people thinking I'm a piece of shit. Like, who's this fucking guy standing out here by this truck? You know what I mean? Yeah, and, like... Uh, no, yeah. I don't think he's trying to steal it. They're like, this queer ain't trying to steal that truck. This vato belongs at Home Depot, eh? Huh. And they were like, hey, Home Depot's like two miles that way, fool. You can just walk. Fuck that truck. Hey, those fools got advanced, fool. Yeah. At the Home Depot here on 75th Ave. Yeah. They stand on a different corner now, fool. So they're not at the same side no more. Oh, they, they don't? Oh, fool, even if I'm coming in a regular car, fool, they attack me. Like, fool, I'm not even in the truck. I'm just trying, yeah. to, I'm just trying to buy some batteries. Oh, okay. So check this out. I had a homie drop drop off the pulley, right? And when I got dropped off at the by my truck, it took me like not even five minutes to put it put it all on and start the truck. It was just it, about having that wheel. It was just about that wheel. And that pendejo at the thing didn't tell you? No, that's the thing. And that's the the first thing was like everywhere I called, nobody told me that. Because I was trying to get the bigger, better deal for the fuck. Now, I'm a cheap motherfucker. Yeah, you fool. already know that. I'll call Penny Pinch. Yeah, I was calling everybody. Everywhere. I called my tío. That fool don't even talk to me. And I fucking call him, hey, man, you don't have a belt. <laughs> and then he's like, well, what size? And I'm like, I'm like a fucking, I'm like a 48 fool because I gained a lot of weight. Nah, mijo, I remember <laughs> when you were little. <laughs> I remember when you were little. I used to change your diaper, bro. And you were still hung like a baby. <laughs> fuck, 19 inches, fucking 7 pounds, loco. A fucking pure <laughs> chorizo still. <laughs> So, no, those pendejos at the place, nobody, no one said anything about that. I found out online. I was watching videos on YouTube, sitting there all bored. And they're like, yeah, if you're going to buy that belt, you need one of these. I was like, what the fuck? Why did somebody say that? Okay. Just, yeah, because they'll sell it to you as a fucking, hey, hey sir, you're going to need this. Yeah. Now, so if your dumbass wants to walk out without it, yeah. you're coming back for it. Yeah. So just take it now. So it all, it all panned out. Now. Here's another thing that happened at fucking Troca. I was driving it yesterday, okay? And it started making this crazy fucking noise, like crazy fucking noise. I don't know what the fuck what it was. I was like, what's that? Oh, shit. And uh-huh. I thought it had something to do with the wheel. I mean, with the with that wheel that I put on and the bell and all that, right? 
So I said, fuck it. I couldn't find anything wrong. So I just turned it off. I said, I'm not going to use it. I am not. I don't give a fuck. I'm going to just leave it here. So I ended up fucking leaving. And then um, when I got home, I told my son, I was like, hey, the truck's fucked up. And then he was like, all right, then well, let's go over there and fucking do what we got to do. Let's let get me, our hands dirty. Let me go do the job you're supposed to do. Yeah, man. let me go do. So let we over. The, let me go be the dad in this situation, <laughs> dad. <laughs> and you know what, bro? I'm always afraid of a vehicle falling on me. Oh, hell yeah, me too. That fool. shit doesn't, like, you don't think about that when you're working on it? Because I do. I do. Hell That's yeah. all I think about. That's a fucking fear. I see that I got to move a little bit. Yeah. I fucking run out of that motherfucker. Bro, I get, I'm so afraid of that shit. Even when I'm fucking checking the tire pressure, I fucking put a jack stand <laughs> under that motherfucker. You know what I mean? Hell yeah. Hey, I, I, I pull up to fucking AutoZone or Exxon anywhere, I put a jack stand under that motherfucker. Fuck yeah, fool. That shit's scary, though. Yeah, so check this out. We end up getting, like, those ramps. Okay, so we take two ramps, we take the jacks, we take the jack stands, and we take the tools. Why are you crying, yes, sir? Because I want to fucking, it brings a tear to my knowing that I'm going <laughs> above and beyond to fix this fucking throat. <laughs> <laughs> so what ends up happening is I crawl under there, and we don't have a flashlight. It's at night now. And your phone's dead. My phone, yeah, my phone was dead. Whose phone isn't dead? I know. So my son's like, here's my phone. Let me be the dad in the situation. And I, I find out that the, the one of the bolts to the fucking starter just came off. Oh, and that shit was just flapping? It was what? rattling, and the starters have, like, these little metal shims. And the little metal shims are just rattling, too. So everything's rattling like crazy, though. Oh, and you just needed to yeah. tighten things up. So I got out, and I go, hey, get under there and check it out. And he said, okay. So he got under there, and he was like... Okay, I need a socket. So then I found the socket he needed, gave and it to him. And you just punched the shit out of it? Or what? <laughs> yeah. So then he, like, it took us longer to jack up the truck than it took for this little vato to fucking fix it, bro. That your son sounds like a genius. Bro. That fool fixed it so quick it wasn't even funny. That's crazy. So you got to go to your son for fucking genius fucking idea. Yeah. That's a good thing, though. It's so good to have a smart up, son, fool. So he ended up fixing it, yeah. So I was just happy that... He, it all worked out, and I drove it over here. I'm so just I'm happy, happy that he's smart, is it? <laughs> Not like his papa. <laughs> You're like, this fool's fucking dumb. He should have he should have paid four fifty for that truck. You know why they call him papa? Because that's what he has in his cerebro, is it? A papa. papa. <laughs> <laughs> hey, fool. One time, my dad allegedly yeah. took his b- boss's truck full to TJ to fucking <laughs> allegedly burn it and do to bring sh- back To bring back some fucking... To allegedly do insurance fraud. <laughs> Yeah. So we got that shit with TJ and one of my fucking, one of my relatives or comrades or something was going to fucking do the holly out there. <laughs> <laughs> so we were fucking cruising for like we took, we got to TJ, whatever. And the next morning we're like, fucking, let's go fucking tear this truck up. Let's go fuck. Let's go to, let's take it through the hills and shit and just fucking go off roading. Yeah. It was a badass truck for a Chevy, I think. Yeah. And my fucking homies driving it. My, my camarada. Yeah. This fucking, this motherfucker's running over trees. Yeah. Fucking, fucking running over trees, all kinds of shit. Fuck. Over fucking pedestrians. Dude, and we're shit. all fucking happy. Fucking, we're like, we're like fucking five. Like Lord of the Flies and shit. We're like five miles from his house, fool, and it's all mountains and shit. Yeah. It's, it's in TJ. Montañas. And this motherfucker's <laughs> running over shit, just trees and shit. And all of a sudden, the truck just stops, fool. Why? Everything shorts out, and the truck radio stops working. What? I mean, it just shorts out. So yeah. And the smoke. What do you mean when you say short tell you guys were listening to too short? Now nah, we're listening to we're watching short circuit. <laughs> <that's it. laughs> and then fuck so we get all like fuck, there's smoke coming out the thing. And I remember this fool was trying to fucking open the hood. And what happened? And he kept burning his hands. And he finally opened it and this fucker the battery was stuck on the hood. What the fuck? How does that happen? Because we were fucking ramp we we're fucking off road. I'm talking like crazy for like Oh, like real bad. Dude, like, we're it was not, nuts. Dude, we're fucking. We're, you guys were surprised the truck didn't flip yeah, with all, all that fucking and, excitement. We thought we were in a video game. Fool. Yeah, it was yeah. so amazing. <laughs> so fucking that shit fucking gets stuck. And this fool fucking tries to fucking grab the battery. I still remember. He burns the shit out of his fingers. He starts spitting on his fingers. <laughs> He's like. <laughs> <laughs> so we're like, fuck, hey, dude. I spit on my fingers when I go to the bathroom. Hey, fool. Thing. That was before even cell phones existed, fool. So and what happened? Nobody had a cell phone, nothing. So he had a beeper. And we're fucking far like a motherfucker. So we tell my brother and my cousin, fucking Kiki, you guys stay at the truck. Me and this fucking gonna hoof it to the, to the canton. 
and pick up a fucking battery or like I don't know, go figure out what the fuck we gotta bring back. I forgot what we did. Yeah. So we're walking back, just fucking laughing, dude. Like that shit was hella fun, bro. So we're walking, and some fools in a doom buggy fucking show up, bro. And what did they say? They just pull up. Hey, motherfuckers, you guys want to ride? Que onda quieren ride? And we're all like, fuck yeah. So they we, give you guys a ride? Yeah, they tell us where we're going. They ask us where we're going. Did we they hop- try to rape you? Twice, fool, but we, ha- <laughs> we had to fight them off, isn't it? But, uh-huh. but we didn't have a, our doom buggy license, so we had to keep them alive to just get us home. So what happened? Nothing. They get us home. We grabbed a fucking, I forgot. I think we just brought another truck to pull that motherfucker. And then we fucking waited till nighttime and with that bitch on fire, dude. For <laughs> real? Right there. Allegedly? The, allegedly. Mm. That never happened. I saw it in the movie. <laughs> so, yeah, hey. that's what happened, bro. I just thought it was cool doing alleged fucking... Allegedly doing alleged, stuff? Allegedly doing uh, insurance frauds. Yeah. You ever been in, allegedly involved in no insurance fraud? I was allegedly somehow tied into someone who knew somebody... Who did that? And I'm going to break it down to you in a way that's truthful, yet eloquacious with my own eloquentiousness. Well, the audience okay. needs you to paint a beautiful fucking okay. picture. Well, the it? audience can go fuck themselves. And go kiss our ass. <laughs> All right. So check this out. This vehicle had to get... Somebody needed to get rid of a vehicle. Okay. They couldn't afford the payment no more. The vehicle fucked up, but they did a, They could afford it, but it was just oh, like... But it, it cost, cost too, too much, much to fix, fix it. Yeah. So it was time to fucking. All right, good night. (laughs) So, what ended up happening was these dudes that I knew, all right, were in a crack house, allegedly. (laughs) I'm not bullshitting you. It was a crack house. And there, you got one side of the crack house that was for fucking the smokers and the crackers and all that bullshit, right? You got the other side of the house, which is for people that just like to have a beer and kick back and play cards. So, one of my homies is playing cards. It was his car. And he tells his other homeboy, hey, fool, I'm going to go blow up this fucking vehicle because I can't afford to fucking keep it. You want to go with me? And he said, when you want to do that? He said, right now. He said, well, just wait a while. Let's get fucked up and we'll do it later. Okay. Ends up being like fucking two or three in the fucking morning when these dumbasses decided to go blow up this fucking car. Okay. They take the car. The car was a convertible. Had a rag top and shit. Yeah, so your homie thought he was the shit. Oh, huh? yeah. His motherfucker thought he was fucking balling yeah, hard. Yeah, he thought right? he was fucking Miklo with the Lokes on with the top down. Yeah. He was like, I got the keys here. That fucking had a, Frankie's that, brother's GTO. That fight a 1996 LeBaron. <laughs> <laughs> like fucking Freddy got fingered. So they ended up, it was two, three dudes ended up going together. Okay. To blow that shit to up. To blow that motherfucker up. The third person went just because he wanted to see some shit blow yeah, up. Yeah, fuck yeah. Who doesn't want to yeah. see some shit blow up? So, my homeboy ends up taking a fucking gas can with like two gallons of gas in it. They get out of the car. He pours it all inside the fucking car. Then he pours the rest of it on top of the fucking rag top. Okay? To soak it up nice yeah. and wet. And... One of the fucking, uh, oh, he ends up lighting the rack top on. And then he tells the other two dudes, let's take off running, motherfuckers. Let's go. So they take off. He takes off running. He's gone. No, these other motherfuckers can run as fast as he can or faster. So he turns around like, what the fuck's going on? Why ain't they fucking running? One of the dudes, okay. Oh, no, no, no. When they put the gasoline on top of the hood. One of them lit a fucking rag on fire and threw the rag on top of the fuck. I mean, on top of the rag top. They threw a little rag like a bandana. They set it on fire and threw, threw it that on top of the whip. And that's when, that's when my homeboy said, run. Okay. Now, when he turned around to see these motherfuckers, like, why ain't they running? He sees one of them grab that fucking rag that's on fire and then throw it through the window. When this dude threw it through the window... The whole fucking car lit up like a fucking Christmas. Like it blew up, bro. Like like the movies. Yeah, like blah. It was loud too. Like what the fuck? So this dude got burned. Okay. He ended up losing his eyebrows, his mustache, the arms. His, like half of his head was fucking like his hair was burnt off. That fool looked like Danny DeVito. <laughs> his fucking arms. 
Lost all hair on his arms, bro. Fuck, dude. All that because this motherfucker didn't want to listen and not run when he was told to. Yeah, let that shit catch on fire slowly. Yes, so. Man. Once it reaches that point, you're gone. This man. is even the worst. This is even worse. It was like two blocks away from the fucking crack house. Oh, they did it right down yeah, the street. Yeah, right like down idiots. the street like idiots. Like fucking retards. So when they get to the crack house, right? We're all fucking standing out there like, what the fuck's going on? <laughs> like, what is that? You see this big old fucking mushroom cloud like a nuke just went off and shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. So this guy comes in, burnt fucking, he's all pink. His hands are out like he's a fucking zombie and shit. He's like, oh, I got burned. We're all, what the fuck? This fool got fucking lit up. That's crazy, fool. Yeah. So then the other dude, the third person, the third party, he was like, hey, man, that's fucked up that this about to let this fool burn up. Like, what the fuck? What are you talking about? He burned himself. Yeah, he burned it? himself. Yeah. He don't fucking listen. That's his own fault. Yeah. So, anywho... The cops didn't find that piece of shit for fucking weeks, bro. <laughs> fucking car just sat there in a fucking vacant lot for... The cops didn't give a fuck. It was a fucked up neighborhood. That's fucking nuts, bro. So the car just sat there. Like, it's like you had to practically call the cops and be like, Hey, man, I think this car got blown up the other night. Because it was probably normal to see fucked up yeah, cars it, out there. Yeah, it was you know just normal, I mean? yeah. So cops fucking... drive by, oh, it was just another fucking car. Yeah, so we were just out there like, Oh, shit, what the fuck happened over there? You know what I mean? Like... Dude. I didn't find out what was going on until it already happened. That's fucking nuts, bro. Yeah, it was crazy. I wish I would have been there just to witness the fucking mushroom cloud. Yeah, it was nuts. You wouldn't think that something like that would blow up and like the, that, but that's what that fool said. He said, that shit fucking blew up like the movies, like fucking crazy. And nobody ever showed up, fool. That's crazy. No cop, no nothing, bro. What the fuck? No, not even a straight dog walk by that fucking stupidness, bro. I guess... Because it was a fucked up neighborhood, man. You know what I mean? It was just a fucked up neighborhood. It was fucking drugs, fucking gangs. It was everything. So the cops just said, like, well, who gives a fuck? Who cares? You know, it's a fucking blown up car, man. Who gives a shit? That's fucking crazy, And the bro. car just sat there, bro. Like, nobody fucking knew anything. It looked like a fucking ashtray. Hey, before I drove by the other day, that car's all tagged up now. <laughs> oh, that car's running now? <laughs> <laughs> fucking, this got a new tranny in it. Kids driving it to high school. Mira, mijo, lo que te compré. <laughs> now look at this new car, bro. It's got that fucking ash charcoal gray. That's what with a new paint job. Hey, but next week, huh? Keep our fingers crossed. What? What's going on? We might have a special, special guest, bro. Oh yeah, special. I mean, how special? He just got off this fucking small bus. It's special. <laughs> He's like, hey, will you be in the podcast? <laughs> no. Nah, so I met a guy that just escaped the fucking cult. Yeah. What do you mean, like? He was stuck in a big ass, like a beer, like a cold, <laughs> cold 45. <laughs> yeah, he was in there before he couldn't get out. No, but he was stuck in a cold, like a little horse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he couldn't get off of that motherfucker. No, for reals, though, but they took him to the store and bought him a cold because it's cold as fuck out it here. It is cold as fuck, dude. Hey, man, I was stuck in this cold, bro. I was stuck in this cold for a while, homie. Yeah. So we might have him on next week if fucking, yeah. if his association. Hey, I want to give a shout out to all the lovely people that bowl. Especially, there's a special bowling team in my heart right now. Highly medicated. Highly medicated. Have you ever seen these fucking guys bowl? I've seen people bowl, and then I've seen these fucking guys. Oh, hell yeah. These guys are the fucking worst bowlers I've ever seen in my hey, life. They, they came in last place in the Special Olympics bowling team. Yeah. Said. How do you get last place in the Special Olympics? I don't know, but we're, we... They were using bumpers, bro. They man. put the bumpers up, and these guys still fucked up the so, fucking yeah, game. So we're going to have highly medicated bowling team on next week. You yes, guys, next week. Next week, we got a star-studded event star going Star-studded up. fucking you event, I mean? so... We got we got musicians, we, we, we got magicians, bit. we got uh, pink big, hearts, we, yellow moons, green clovers, fucking purple stars. We got all that shit. We got magazines. We got big titties. Yeah. We got everything. So we got you, nipples, we got tamales. So you guys are into titty fucking, listen to last episode. <laughs> so, yeah, because Big Titty Mike, he's a killer on the mic. Yeah. Hey, I'm not gay or nothing, but I'll fucking motorboat those fucking tetas. I'm you not gay. <laughs> 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 hey, I, I mean? I'm not gay or nothing, but I'll give him a fucking chili dog. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man. I don't know what to get, Big Titty Mike. I was thinking about getting him a bra, but then I'm like, everybody gets him a bra. Like, everybody, for every, he even told me, he's like, man, every Christmas, all I get is bras. For my birthday, all I get is bras. I don't know what to fucking, I don't know what to get this guy. 
It's like everybody's beating me to the punch. Should I get them bras? Should I get them like two propellers to put on there? Should I put the get them the little you know tinsels? Should I get the them? tinsels? Yeah, the tinsels are nice. That'll be nice. Yeah, but you he know? probably has a couple pairs of those. Oh, he already has that. He does. Yes, and sir. I'm thinking, where can I get Big TV Mike? An authentic so he, gift. An authentic gift for those tits. I mean, because they're not just regular tits. It's not like you look at his tits and you're like, okay, it's a dude with tits. Hey, bro, get him the world's smallest stretch Armstrong. It's only $5 at Target. <laughs> Do they really sell that at yeah, Target? Yeah, for he's like this small. Is Every, he little? Uh, Brody bought him. And what happened? Is he really stretched? Yeah, like the motherfucker? he's cute, dude. Oh, that's cool, man. Cutie stretch Armstrong. Oh, um, that's what I used to call my wang, Stretch Armstrong. <laughs> no, but Big T D Mike, if you're out there, hey, we miss you, we miss you. My verga wants to kiss you. you know? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Fuck yeah! You got any words for the microphone, Essa? You good? We got a we got a fucking paparazzi, so I'm just <laughs> we asking. We got the paparazzi. If you guys questions for the podcast, right now is the time to ask. You know, mm-hmm. we got chorizo. His mustache is freshly trimmed. <laughs> Pincha Pancho Villa looking <laughs> motherfucker over here. Hey, so what you been up to, Tolo? What'd you do this week? Anything interesting? This week, fuck, dude, I forget everything I do. I smoke so much bud. Hey, I was gonna ask Half you. Half my life is fucking in the clouds, homes. <laughs> hey, I was gonna ask you, whatever happened to that little pimp you used to drive around? You don't have his number? I want to interview oh, him. Oh, so check this out. I don't think... Did we ever talk about the little pimp? Yeah. You, I don't you think picked I did. Him up, you picked him up on in the... But have we talked to about him on the podcast? You know what? I don't remember. So check this out. Back in the day, it was probably like, what, two, three weeks ago? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's like, Tolo so fucking high. He thinks it happened like 10 years ago. He's like, hey, man, back in the day, bro, when so, there was a wildfire so in California. So check this out. I, I'm a fucking Lyft driver for fucking fun. Mm-hmm. And I pull up to pick up this fucking black girl. Yeah. Why do I have to say? Why, why does she have she, to be black? Girl? Because she got, got a big, she got a nice booty. But I went to go pick up this girl who has a nice booty. I pull up and then I see a vato with her fucking hitting a blunt like all fast to try to turn it off. So yeah. She's fucking, I'm all right, cool. She turns it off. They get in the whip. I'm all, it's like a 20 minute ride. Yeah. So I'm like, hey, if was, that, I'm all, was that a blunt, homie? You were fucking. Were you burning a fucking blunt and shit? So I'm going to check this out, homie. Light that one up and light this one up, too. So I, put, I hand him a fresh one, homie. And what does he say? Oh, they get all, he gets all pumped up. He gets on Instagram and Snapchat. Oh, shit, look, I'm on live fucking smoking Hell a blunt. Hell yeah, smoking a blunt. And I'm like, yeah, fuck you. Listen to the Roach Clip podcast. Don't, <laughs> don't even talk to me, poots. <laughs> so then what happens? So I drop him off. He's like, hey, you know where I could get some fucking verde? I'm like, yeah, go get your medical card, put on. Go to the dispensary <laughs> like a fucking, like the rest of us. That's Hold like, on, be a fucking G, bro. This is the new millennium. Yeah, so I, 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 um, I don't bring him a, I don't bring him a quarter pound. I don't bring him none of that, you know, that he wants. Yeah. You know, I don't make money off him. I don't bring him the Percocets that he wants. I yeah, don't, you know, Viagra, no. Percocets, Percocet, condoms, condoms, all kinds of shit. clients. <laughs> so, you don't bring him any of that shit. None of that. So we pull up, and that's Vato goes like, You pull hey. up, and he pulls out. He pulls out, <laughs> and we both have a fucking good time. <laughs> No, no, so he, we pull up, he offers me a job, and say, you want to be, be a man a whore? Hooker? You want to be a man whore? <laughs> I know a couple of you. He's all, yepa, 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 what door do I pick? Like, I know a couple of you. He does it like chubby Mexican, chubby hairy Mexican. Hey, maybe he wanted to paint you like an Aztec princess. Hey, maybe he wanted to make me an Eskimo. <laughs> Eskimo. <laughs> so fucking, we pull up, he's like, hey, bro, would you fucking work on the side, homie, like under the table? Just, I'll just pay you. What you, were you going to be doing under the table? You know. Under the mess I gave him cabeza. <laughs> <laughs> so then what happened? I'm like, fuck yeah, bro. Like, he's I like, just drive my girls around, like, from, oh, shit. from hotel to hotel. I'll give you a call. Yeah. I'm all right, let's do this. That's it. Were they? Were hey, they, bro, w- I couldn't get this motherfucker off my phone, dude. What do you mean? He was standing on your phone? Oh, yeah. Just, I was like, get <laughs> off, that's it. <laughs> I tried to make a phone call, home. Uh, get off my phone, puto. <laughs> yeah, he kept calling me for fucking flavors and favors. Yeah. Hey, can you pick Asking this? for dumb shit. Yeah, can you pick this? Oh, yeah. I swear. Asking for dumb, dumb yeah, shit. Yeah, I know. This motherfucker's hey, asking bro, you can, for like. Hey, can you bring me a burrito? I'll give you a hundred bucks. <laughs> yeah, like, this motherfucker's fuck. asking for some dumb shit. Yeah, like, I'll bring you a yeah. burrito. Give me hey, a can you bucks. bring me a bag of ice? I'm in Tucson. You're like, what the fuck? By the time I get there, there's going to be a bottle of water, puto. He's going to make it worth your while. Uh, hey, hey, can you give me a cup of sugar, man? I'm trying to impress this new hooker I got. 
Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, this fool always had badass rooms full like in Scottsdale and shit. Yeah, like nice rooms. Yeah, like heated pools and all that. Like you could you could swim there right now, fool, yeah. and feel like you're in fucking paradise. Huh. That's how they got it in Scottsdale. Bro. They it, got that weather control from North Korea. <laughs> it's funny you said that because I used to do fucking uh maintenance at an apartment complex. Right? This motherfucker. Always talking about apartment complex. <laughs> yeah, man. I love apartment complex. There's a lot of bullshit that happens it in complex. It is complex. a lot of bullshit that happens. So this dude knocks on my door that I know, right? And he's like, hey, man, hey, can I get like three eggs? And I go, yeah, no problem. So I go to the refrigerator, hand this motherfucker three eggs. Oh, yeah, you brought him the ad from Fry's. Look, they said they're on sale. <laughs> La docena, I'm no, 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 cool. He was a dude that was single. You know, he was a cool dude. This food, this food broken down to fractions. I paid $3 for the dozen. <laughs> That's fucking sixty eight cents an egg, so you owe me a dollar thirty eight, sir, when you get paid. <laughs> <laughs> I got an invoice and shit I'm like showing it to him. I'm like, look, man, fuck your fries card. You're paying full price. You're paying full price. That's it. All right. I don't give fuel points, Holmes. <laughs> so he ends up coming back. I'm not making this shit up, man. I wish I was. He could basically like, hey man, do you happen to have some crackers? And then I was like, What kind of crackers? He's like, like those saltine crackers. You have some of those? Like the Nabisco? And I'm like, yeah. I'm Mexican, yeah. So I fucking, I go get Every Mexican I go, how much rice. crackers do you need? So I give him some. You, you give know? him the whole pack? You give no, him I don't give him the whole pack. I just give him like half of the one of those little packages. Damn, you cheap bastard. I know, I'm a cheap motherfucker. This mother co- motherfucker comes back. I'm not making this shit up, bro. Comes back. Okay? Hey, uh, Chudy, so do you happen to have some, uh, I don't know, maybe like two pounds of ground beef? This is the two asked, pounds of ground beef. This is what he asked me, and I was like, "Wait a minute, man! What the fuck's going on, dude?" Is it- I go, "I give you eggs, I give you crackers. Now you're asking me for fucking ground beef. What the hell's going on?" He's like, "No, man, because I got this fucking dying piece coming over, man. I'm trying to impress her and shit, and I'm trying to get her, make her some meatloaf." I go, "Motherfucker, I'm making her the meatloaf." Yeah, what the I'm fuck? Making, and he tell her to get his dick sucked. Yeah, I'm like, tell her to give me some fucking snacks. Yeah, you know give me some chon chon. That's it. I'll invite you guys to dinner. I know. Cause I was fuck- like. Hey, I'll, I'll watch you guys fuck. Yes, sir. I don't give a fuck, homie. Yeah, I'll sit there and fucking pat my pud. This motherfucker, bro, was asking me for all the ingredients. Why didn't he ask for them all at once? I know. Hey, and he kept cool. coming back. I want to make meatloaf, homie. You know, every time he'd leave, I'd go back to the bathroom hey, and do but, my knuckle hey, show. but he had a good fucking recipe going. <laughs> no, I know. But the I crackers didn't. probably make it taste bomb, fool. Oh, you never used it with crackers? Nah, I used oh, the breadcrumbs. Yeah, use crackers, bro. Fuck. Yeah, it makes it taste bomb, yeah. I just, crackers. You learn something new every day, mm-hmm. huh? Mm-hmm. Okay. I put jalapenos in mine too. You so, don't do that? Nah. Put jalapenos in it. Fuck it. Ooh. I put my jalapeno in everything. Hell yes, yeah. Sir. Everything that walks, everything that talks, everything that moves, <laughs> everything that sleeps. We, well, that we don't call them jalapenos. We call them Mexican pickles. Yeah, you ever remember the first time hearing a girl queef? Mm-hmm. I couldn't, dude. I laughed before I swear. Yeah, it was my tia. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, anywho. Anywho, I got that fucking pimp. I'm fucking driving his chicas everywhere. <laughs> yeah, hey. He's with, allegedly with buying his, fucking drogas off of me. Yeah, well, were the chicas, were they heavy? Nah, they're all fucking little thin fucking, like, skinny girls, bro. Yeah. Because the white boys love them, fool. The, he said, like, it's oh. all, like, old businessmen, bro, that call his highness. Oh, and they like fucking skinny girls. Yeah, and then every time to be, fool. I you got to be careful when you're banging a skinny girl, bro, because if you're hitting a doggy style and you look at her. No, her, it looks like she swallowed a birdcage, fool. If you hit it too hard, fool, you'll sink in that motherfucker. Yeah, you got to be careful. They're, they're nothing but oil, eh? Yeah. They ain't got nothing but it's a like hole. A, it's like sticking your dick in a cage and shit. <laughs> it is, fool. It, 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 it don't make no sense. It don't make no sense. It's like fucking a pallet. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> it's like sticking your dick through a fence. It, <laughs> it, don't, is, make no fool. Sense. it don't make no sense. <laughs> so then I'll be with this fool, and then he'd be talking to his baby mama. She like yeah. in Sacramento, so I'm like, Business, like fucking a chicken coop. Like some rich business lady, but then you'd hear a pimp break down, bro. What? You know what I mean? When, when huh, pimp down, ba- pimp. Hey, baby pimp mama, stress. Baby mamas could fucking break down any fucking man, bro. Even a fucking pimp. Yeah, so you what happened? Oh, you know, he'd be like, come on, girl, I just sent you $2,000. <laughs> <laughs> Shit like that, bro. And then He's like, girl, you already know how we do it. You know? What was it? Did he have a crazy ass pimp name? Fuck, I don't remember his fucking name because I just called him Money Mike because he reminded me of that fool. He a was, Money Mike? Oh, he, he was tiny like, like that fool. Oh, he tiny, was? Tiny, tiny. Dude, his hoes were bigger than him. Fool. Yeah, he was like, hey, you can lead a hoe to water, but you can't make her think, player. <laughs> yeah, like that. <laughs> he was fucking tiny fool. Yeah. And then um, one, the last time I seen him, 
He picked up a sack for me. Wait a minute, allegedly. he picked up your sack? He picked up my sack for <laughs> it's me. It's all sweaty and shit. He he's like, all, man, he's it feels like a soggy kiwi, mija. He's all served, coughed three times. I'm like, damn, you a pimp and a doctor? <laughs> he doesn't fuck around. He doesn't he fuck has, around. Hey, he's got to make sure these girls are clean, bro. He's all, I got to make sure my Lyft driver is fucking <laughs> past a physical essay <laughs> in case one of my hoes goes down. Yeah, hey. the, so the last time I seen him this was... Ma- this motherfucker thought you had sickle cell. <laughs> <laughs> hey, rest in peace, fucking prodigy. Yeah. Hey, did he die because of sickle yeah, cell? Yeah, sickle cell. Hey, dude, it's going to sound like a joke. The most fucked up way to die, bro. Is what? He died the most fucked up way you can Bull die. Bullfucking shit, bro. Hey, bro, he choked on the fucking hard-boiled egg for in the hospital. Who did? Prodigy from Mob Deep. No, he didn't. That's how he died, fool, officially. Because he was all weak, though. You know what I mean? Yeah. And he choked on the hard-boiled egg, carnal. That's fucked oh, up. Oh, right? that's fucked up. It is fucked up, fool. One of the most gangster motherfuckers. Yeah, he, and he choked on a fucking hard-boiled egg. Yeah, dude, because he was asking his neighbors, fool, for huevos, because he was trying to make <laughs> meat low fese. Yeah. So was I. <laughs> so lo mandó a la verga neighbor, so he had a hard-boiled egg, and he choked on that. No, he, but, he choked, dude. So the last time I seen the pimp, his fucking one of his hoes had been in the hospital for like I don't know how many days. For how long? I don't know. And I was in the back seat, and she's all telling me her whole story. Fool. What was she telling? I she's never like, felt yeah. bad for a hoe, fool. <laughs> this time you felt bad. Yeah, for Yeah, she's all telling you me know, all her medical. Pers- and, and there was and there was an AIDS or none of that shit. She was like, I couldn't move my legs from the waist down because Money Mike was eating me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. So she's like, yeah, I did like transfusions and all. She was all sad in the back seat. Fuck. Hey, and he then, better get rid of her, bro. I don't got time for no fucking chick town. I gotta check her instantly, like every five minutes and shit. Yeah. So after we that, gotta go eat at Whole Foods because of her fucking dumb ass. Yeah, he's nah. all going to Whole Foods and all this shit, buying fucking spinacas and all that. <laughs> yeah, she's all fucking. Hey, baby, you gotta buy me some more test strips. She's like, bitch, you better strip for that over <laughs> Stop, stop thinking about yourself, mija. That's all she thinks about herself. You better use your fucking FSA so I haven't, card. So I haven't heard of Money Mike since then, bro. Oh, man. You should have kept Money Mike's number, bro. I should have. Because that that's an interesting character right there. He yeah, could have told cool. us all kinds of crazy I shit. I think the last time I called him, that phone was off. Because you know how pimps do it. Yeah, they get a new phone, they get every, a new phone every state. Two weeks. Yeah, or either yeah. that or he's in jail for not paying his fucking child support. Yeah. One time true. I did pick up his baby mama from the airport. Oh, you did? He's like, hey, bro, can you pick up my baby mama and my son? And did you pick them yeah, both they, up? Yeah, like, they told me with turban on everything. And you picked them up? Yeah, I picked them up. Oh. I picked that for first, and he came with me. Yeah. And oh, well, like, that's cool. I was like, damn, fucking pimp down, pimp down. <laughs> pimp in distress. Yeah, I'm stuck was, between a rock and a hard place. He was, fool. Yeah. He was. That's hey, Terry Crews is fucking suing. Who's he suing now? That company. Uh, that, that grabbed his ass? <laughs> the the fool. The company that dude works for, because they hired, they suspended him, but he's back working with them now. So yeah, he, so he's suing that company, dude, for fucking because that fool grabbed his pito a couple times. Yeah, but there's no proof of that dude grabbing his pito. Oh yeah, there is. There's like all kinds of witnesses, fool. Oh, there was. Yeah, fucking Ben. Are Affleck. they gonna back him up? Ben Affleck had to fucking intervene to Did stop they? it. Not uh, what's that other fool? Ben Affleck was all jealous. He's like, hey, let me grab that motherfucker. <laughs> no, uh, Mag Light. The other fool, Water Boy. What the fuck? Wait a minute. Adam so, Sandler. Adam Sandler intervened. Yeah, he was there. His wife was there. Yeah, Terry and Cruz's like, wife was and there. And they were like, hey, don't be grabbing and his dick. And that fool grabbing his pito. Why, what was he saying? Like, hey, is it really fucking, does it look like a baby's arm holding an apple? It probably does, fool. It was all. And that fool got to be hung like a caballo. Fuck, that's crazy. What, it looked like a two by four? So check this out, bro. I got to ask you a question. Mm. How's that beer tasting now? I don't know. I like the blonde better. Yeah, me too. The blonde really, where'd you get these? The blondies? At yeah. QT, fool. They have them at QT? They got the Apex. How much are those? Like $8? Uh, 10 bucks for an 8-pack. Yeah. I mean, it's not bad if you're a fucking yeah, it's broke. Wor- it's worth it. But if you're broke, it's kind of expensive. Hey. We got the Paz Blue River, so what's up? You know, up? you could still from fucking Circle. You want to know why they let you get away with beer rooms at Circle K? Hey, fool, you know what the craziest shit I stole from Circle K? Uh, somebody's virginity. Because me and my homie, me and my, <laughs> me and my homie used to battle, bro, so you could steal the craziest shit. Oh, right? yeah, it's fun doing that. Oh, I used to love okay, so I was Jack pay- battling. I was paying at Circle K. Yeah. In the Vato You were tur- painting the Circle K? <laughs> yeah, I was paying. Fuck, fool. You, <laughs> yeah, I, you want to ja- make money no matter what. I'm a jack of all trades, that's it. Oh, this Vato said, hey, I was painting the Circle K. <laughs> hey, and, the, and the Vato turns around, and I grab the whole thing of big lighters, fool, and walk out with them. The Hell whole, yeah, the that's whole, the way to do it, yeah. The whole display. Yeah. 
and my homies behind me, he was about to pay. So that's why I had to one up me. <laughs> yeah, what did he do? He took he, a video game? <laughs> nah, he, he took his own display. He grabbed the other one on the other side. Uh-huh. So we had a shit little big lighter. <laughs> food, just like <fucking, laughs> Hey. Yeah, because hey, me and my homie used to make, uh, we used to fill up gallons with, <laughs> with gasoline a little bit. Yeah. And then stick like 10, like 10, 15 lighters in there, the little big ones. Yeah. And we'll light them on fire. We'll do all kinds of dumb shit, fool. I have that, all that shit on video. Yeah. But one time, bro, we were, on the, we were at that fool's fucking um, detailing shop at his car wash. Yeah. And we fucking caught the whole field on fire, dude. What? How and big was the field? It was pretty big, but me and my homie, fool, we, we could have, we had the hose ready, fool, and we're all tripping out like... You panic, bro. Yeah, you don't of know course. what to do. Yeah, you don't know and what the to hose do. was there, and we finally grabbed it and just turned that shit off. And then my homie walks out, he sees that fucking shit all cinch. Yeah. He just got pissed, bro, and just fucking. What was he saying? Nothing. What the fuck can he say? Yeah. And that fool just laughed and fucking kept lighting shit. Hey, did you ever. Hey, fool, if you have a thousand lighters, hey, one time Proli fucking. Did you ever go to Juvie? Nah, but one time Proli. Oh, we'll go back to that right now. All right. One time Proli allegedly. Fucking Jackson Brewski's from Circle K. Yeah. And then the fucking old lady from that works there, fool, comes and chases us. She was old? Old, fool. And she gets in front of Prodi's car like, don't fucking leave. What? And Prodi allegedly just hits the gas a little bit. And what happened? That lady gets scared and runs inside the fucking store, dude. Oh, and shit. we did, fool. Hey, but why don't, why don't you get in trouble for doing beer runs? At Circle K, why do they let you? I'm going to... The crime rate's going to go up after fucking everybody hears what I'm about I got, to say right now. Because I got a lot of beer run stories. That's it. Oh, yeah, man. I allegedly participated in so many fucking beer runs. It's not even funny. I got so, I got so tired of stealing beer and drinking beer at one point during my teenage years that I just started stealing fucking root beer. That's, it. <laughs> it was, that's how bad it got. <laughs> you made bro. it fun. Hell, it. yeah. We started making floats and shit, illegal floats. You know what I'm saying? I was like, hey, did you pay for that ice cream? If they did, I'd kick them the fuck out you of made my those, house. You made the leche with titty milk? <laughs> Hell, yeah. I'm like, hey, Mike, what are you doing right now? We need some. We need a re-up. <laughs> hey, we, I need you to fill up a couple of gallons for me in the homies' homes. All right, give me 10 minutes. <laughs> I'm on my way. <laughs> <laughs> so why don't you get in trouble for doing beer? Oh, no, no, no. You'll get in trouble, but what I'm saying is this. Let me rephrase how I'm going to put this, all right? At Circle K, they're not allowed to chase you. They're allowed to let you. You're just allowed to walk out with fucking beer. You know why? Because I swallowed a fly. <laughs> nah, all and right. perhaps I'll die. Yeah, okay. they're not allowed to chase you? Well, I don't know because it's not worth it. I don't know what to tell you. No, no, but keep going. What you got? What you got? Oh, shit. All right, so why, okay. aren't, why aren't they allowed to okay. chase you? They just don't do... I don't know why they're not, but there is a reason, there's a reason why. Okay. Circle K has this real good insurance. Okay? So, if you steal from any other store, like beer, their their insurance companies are not going to pay them whatever the bills, beer's worth. Okay? Circle K, unlike all the other convenience stores, unlike all the other fucking stores, at Circle K, the insurance company pays the Circle K per beer. So, if you steal a 30-pack... They're getting thirty dollars a Worth. dollar per beer. Oh, so they get even more money. They for get stealing. more money. So if you're stealing, they still make more feria. So go ahead and take all the fucking beer you want, fool. We're getting our money, hey. no matter how you look at it. Hey, let's pause this real quick. We okay, got a go special ahead. guest. All right, go ahead. Hey, so fuck Chorizo and his beer runs. We had a little interruption, but the interruption's worth it. Yeah. We got, fuck it. Introduce yourself, homie. Who do we got in the we motherfucking house? We got a special house? guest on the road. We, we don't even know what to call a ghost. Yeah. Man, We're, just call me Wes, man. We got West, 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 West. We got the West Sider, West, West, y'all. And now we're back on the podcast. We just we did a quick Circle K run. We actually bought the beers. Tell them what you yeah. bought, Chorizo. Okay, I bought a We're six We're going to try one. Bef- so we fucking go wet. We fucking... Drove and drunk, drunk and drive. What do yeah. you call that, dude, when you get a DUI? Hey, I don't know, but I could barely, barely hear myself. You could barely hear? Yeah. You keep talking. Are we all the same right now? Yeah. Like, are we all? I just want to be equal with everybody. Of course, dog. Yeah. Of all right, course, anyways. Boy, I mean, just because your skin is darker, I'm not going to treat you any fucking <laughs> less fucking better than the rest of us. You know what I mean? Okay, bro. These fucking beers are childproof. Anyways, we just stopped at Circle K. We got these. are called Orange Blossom. All right, cool. So let's... let's Mandarin let's, wheat. Hey, let's do the fucking... 
proper thing and not hand one to our guests. That's yeah, because the guests never get to They one. never get shit, Holmes. Nah, I'm hey. just joking. Give him the first try, homie. It's all right. It's all right. We got Modelo. Give him the first Give him the first sip, though. Give us chorizo. Or who wants to try it first? That's it. Mm. You want to wait till you're done with that? Yeah. Okay. Tell the audience what you're drinking. Ghost in town, West West. Modelo. We got a Modelo what? Well. Is oh, that the what one? Is that? The, the, the sangria the, or whatever? The chilada, the chilada one. Yeah, the enchilada one. Can beat it, man. Two for five. Yeah, I like You get it with cheese. Okay. You get it with a little bit of queso. It's oh, hey, where are my micheladas? There was two the bags. Yeah, I told you to grab oh, one. Oh, fuck. I'll go get them right now. Oh, oh they're the same kind that, that yeah, uh, the Ghost West has? Kind of. Might have tamarindo. He got the, ri- the originals. Oh, okay. You, hey, you took ha- it. Hand me a blossom, though, homie. I want to try this orange blossom. Okay, then. Let's go. All right, so fucking. Here you go, bro. All right, hold on. Sorry, guys. We're trying to get a situated. I'm gonna roll a. I'm gonna roll a joint for our guests right hey, here. I'm gonna give this a sip real quick to tell you what it tastes like. Hope it don't taste like your fucking mustache. I'm tired of that taste. All right, then I will never purchase these again. They're gross. They're disgusting. Fuck, dude. You don't scare me. Actually. Anything You'll that's like- brown and yellow, orange or whatever that is. Yeah. I wouldn't buy. Yeah. Too suspicious. Oh, this is Too delicious. Too suspicious, man. I know. I said That's why I said it. You'll probably like it, but. This is not bad. Because you like all. drinking Coors Light and shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's not bad Anything at all. Anything that's brown, I'm not drinking, man. Like yeah. brown? What do you mean? The, the, the can? can? Why not? What's the bias against that? Too suspicious. Too suspicious, yeah, man. Yeah, it, yeah. It, it looks like it was made in the 70s. Yeah. Hell yeah. That shit was made in the hey, 70s. Hey, but your zigzags are fucking orange. Hey, yeah, but this shit but was made in know. fucking AZ. So what does that tell us? Hey, was it? Oh, yeah. It? What's it the is. brew? What the brewery company name? It's called. Let me. Check, it's called Hus Brewing Company. Hey, Joe. I mean, fucking ghost. It says uniquely Arizona. <laughs> there's the even a picture sip, of the sick. fucking. There's an even a picture of the Arizona state right there. All right, so ghost. The last time I I spoke to you, homie. You were talking about. You wanted to bring something up about flat Earth. Yeah, let's talk about flat Earth. What's, on, what's up with flat Earth, homie? You believe in flat Earth? Or you think the flat earthers are retarded? It's only flat when we're high, man. I don't That's know about everything else. Yeah. These people in the world, who knows? But everybody got to have me thinking of something. Yeah. When you're high, what do you mean it's flat when you're high? Yes, yeah. Well, oh. think about it, dude. When you're high, you think everything is flat. You walk weird. I think you're... Talk weird. Your, your you flat think top weird. is nice. <laughs> Hey, I don't think fucking Big Titty Mike has flat tits. <laughs> hey, no matter how you how look, high you hey, get, you look at Big Titty Mike. Those shits will never be flat. <laughs> you can smoke the sweetest Shiva and in the world. In the world, Big Titty it. Mike has a fucking set of knockers on him that are making fucking. Look, here's what I think about flat Earth. That's it. If if Earth was flat, there would be no mountains. There'll be fucking. We'd be in a two D parallel universe. That's it. We'd be walking. It just wouldn't be what we are right now, homie. We're fucking three-dimensional fucking people, I said. Yeah. You know what I mean? What yeah, do you I think got... about flat earth, homie? I just think that. Do you think it's flat or do you believe the fucking nonsense of the round earth? Bro, how the fuck is it flat, bro? <laughs> exactly. Look it's... at the moon. Okay. They have pictures of it when they were standing on the moon and it's round as fuck. It's round so as fuck. <laughs> but I then there's understand. people that don't believe the, the moon landing's real. Yeah, well, guess what? I don't know about that moon landing bullshit. I think we're throwing away and all that fucking going to the fucking Mars bullshit. All I want to you know, know I mean? can you grow weed in, in Mars? In Mars? Mars? Yeah. Hey. hey, you probably grow the best fucking ganja up there, dog. Yeah. That's You're the probably... first thing. Let me know if you can grow weed in Mars. Yeah, and if you could grow some weed in Mars, then. Yeah. Then we're in fucking, we're in business. We're in business. We're, would you move to Mars, dog, if you could? Yeah. If you it, could, hey, if check, you knew that we're going to war with Korea, because we probably are in like a couple hey, of days. Well, here's something that's really going to happen. This uh, Elon Musk, he's building a rocket that's going to fucking pop. He wants to fucking populate Mars. That's uh, yeah. By, he wants to send his first fucking people up there by like 2020 or some shit. That's like around the corner. That's fucking cool. Yeah. I'll fucking move to Mars. Would you? Fuck yeah, dude. Hey, I thought a whole new colony. Yeah. A whole colony, dude. Hey, what would you do for if you were yeah, if you were the king of your colony? Like, what how would you do? Like first, like if you were got your let's you're, say you had like four hundred bitches and they were all fine, or not even just you're, you're <laughs> the owner of the colony. I say, how would you run it? Like, how God would you damn, even start? Four hundred, four hundred bitches. I don't know if I can get to all those bitches. <laughs> too many bitches. Yeah, yeah. You can, and then you know, bitches get crazy, bro. You don't want too many of those around. Hey, the crazy ones are the favorite ones. Yeah, but fuck, you can't put up with them. That. 
<laughs> he's like, I don't know about all that. I don't fool. know about that, man. Hey, Ghost, do you think we're going to go to war with North Korea? Well, if we do, hopefully we got good shit over here because I ain't about to die here soon. Yeah. I want to live a little longer. Fuck yeah. that. But you think they're bluffing, yes, eh? Those motherfuckers ain't smart enough to blow anybody up. Yeah. The other thing they do is blow themselves up. That yeah. probably, that's probably true. don't know what they're playing with. Yeah. This ain't firecrackers, motherfuckers. <laughs> I know. That's what I, I'm ain't. always like. Every time they send a fucking, like, a missile out, I'm thinking... Do you know how fucking dumb these motherfuckers are? It's like, like you're throwing dude. rocks at somebody who has nothing but guns. You think they're going to wipe themselves off the fucking planet Earth? The only thing that sucks is, like, it's a bad position to be in because you got South Korea, and they don't want no pelo with North Korea at all. You know what I mean? Because they're, like, prospering. Think about it. Well, South, yeah, and then they're fucking the neighbors, fool. Who's yeah, gonna get who's, first? who wants to fuck with the neighbors? Like, mm-hmm. hey, these neighbors are cool, and they're rich, and they're fucking... But these neighbors are assholes. But these like, those are assholes. Like to fucking build firecrackers in his garage all day. Bonfires in the backyard. In the backyard. And have, a podcast. And have a podcast. They're allowed till fucking 2 a.m. Fuck that fat Chino, bro. What the fuck is he thinking, dude? Yeah, I know. That's hey, would you thing. fight him, Ghost? Hey, would you throw down one on one? I don't know about fighting that? that motherfucker because he might end up feeding me to the dogs like he did the rest of his fucking <laughs> yeah, family, bro. He did do that. He did that to uh, his brother in law. He with did? That shit. Yeah. I didn't know that. Hey, do you know about that, Ghost? Oh, oh man. I haven't even seen his wife. Oh, what the fuck is his wife, dude? <laughs> yeah, come on, dude. Did he feed him to the fucking dogs, dude? I think his yeah. wife is fucking Dennis Rodman, Holmes. Yeah. I always see them together. Hey, you ever see Dennis Rodman crying when they're interviewing him? Because they're like, why are you friends with him? And he's like, why are you guys always picking on me? Thank you, sir. I'm like the only <laughs> clean one at the podcast. <laughs> God damn, I didn't know I was at a church. Ex- ex- <laughs> except his fucking calzones. Because oh, yeah. I'm always shitting myself. Hey, for F- hey, when's the last time you shit yourself? Ghost. Shit. <laughs> Ghost, be honest with, be honest honest with us. You know we what? ask everybody. It's not about shit. It's about fucking. Oh, just the squirts? Dude, sometimes, yeah. you know, you go eat something and it just doesn't doesn't it, feel good. You know what I mean? And Well, yeah. And here at the podcast. You know, shit. I don't know about shitting myself, but goddamn. Well, here at the podcast, shitting yourself is a fucking. It's a must. It's a must. It's a. <laughs> yeah. It's a. Care- it's like part of the show. Oh, it yeah, is. It's, it's like a, pa- a re- retro over here. Like, yeah. Yeah. This fool shits his pants more than you could imagine, bro. Yeah. I, last time I had it took a me shit was when I was trick or treating this past Halloween. Yeah. Go listen you to that it? episode. What is <laughs> yeah. it? Episode is. It's the, called Scrap. Craptacular. The Halloween craptacular. This yeah. one took a shit in downtown Phoenix while he took his kids trick or treating, bro. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah. Let's not get into that. You gotta go back hey, to the bro. Episode. You know what? Something we never mentioned. When we that? went to that fucking hip hop festival downtown. Yeah, How we never horrible did. Horrible. These fucking rappers are. Hey, these rappers, hey, bro, bro. They're fucking. Ho- it's horrible, dude. These motherfuckers have big heads. And they were acting like the shit didn't stink, and they didn't even have a record deal. And all they do is fucking mumble. Yeah, and they're like mumble, no, man, jumble, no, mumble. No, no, no. I was just like, bro, who the fuck knows who you are? Nobody knows you. You got like four dudes surrounding you like they're your entourage. It's and horrible, like, dude. And you act like you're fucking 50 and then they all shit. Come, hey, for I had a blunt, and they're all like, hey, bro, you got another Dutch master? I was like, nah, bro, this is my last one. Hell yeah, but I ain't sharing shit And then some other about those like, can I hit it? And his homie's like, nah, fool. That ain't your butt, homie. Oh, that's what he said? Yeah, but... What he meant, buddy, you mean like but friend? Out of what I got out of that fucking hip-hop festival is all these new rappers are fucking horrible. Who was there, anyways? Who who, who came down to, uh, to that festival? I don't who, know, bro. It was just a bunch of local bunch artists. A bunch of local bro. artists, bro. They sound like, like nobody sh- knows about. They're, they're horrible, dude. There was I mean, a couple of good ones, but most of them were fucking One of them booty. that looked like E-40 and the outside stage. Yeah, he was That good. motherfucker was getting down. That other dude had a good following with the red hair. His name was Wayne Wayne. Oh, Wayne Wayne was pretty cool. Yeah, he was down. He should get on the podcast yeah, so we Wayne can fucking roast that was, fucking He had idiot. a nice little following. He did, did he, huh? Yeah, he really did. He had that fucking crowd going bananas, bro. Hey, Ghost, we, we need to take Ghost out with us one of these days, bro. Yeah, so downtown. 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 Yeah, invite, invite, man. Oh, yeah, God, hey. Damn. Remember about that, that angry fucking crackhead who wanted to fucking throw down? When he was like, what the oh, fuck yeah, you laughing yeah. at this? And he, he wanted to throw fucking down. throw down with Chorizo, dude, <laughs> yeah. a crackhead in downtown Phoenix, bro. Yeah, because I was, I was laughing weed. at him. What is this shit called, man? That's called Tour de France. It's OG Kush and fucking oh, Sour Diesel. Yeah, right. It's called Tour de France because that motherfucker's taking hey, fucking full. steroids. Tour. <laughs> it's Tour de France. We got ghosts man. over here panicking, dude. He don't man. even. Man. I think Tour he lost. Tour de France? Fuck. I think fucking, I think Ghost fucking lost his fucking mind this Yeah, hey, I think he's like, he likes to I don't think he li- I don't think he likes to talk much, Holmes, because. It's not even about that, man. It's, I'm tr- I'm trying to get high, fellas. Man, it's kind of hard to think when you're sober. 
<laughs> it is, though. Get, man, pass, pass, yeah. pass. He's going to start reading the Bible right now. So, uh, he gets everybody. Start reading the scripture. Oh. Four score seven years ago. Oh, shit, that's the Gettysburg Address. I got all my fucking. Hey, Ghost, we ask everybody on the podcast, do you remember the first time you got laid? Oh, man, don't even say that Can because I don't remember. Was, <laughs> was it that? Oh, you don't? You really I don't. don't? You really I don't, don't remember? remember? Dude. Oh, shit. This fool does, has done many was fucking it, drugs. Yes, man, I, I couldn't remember having my first blow. Dude, it's so hard. Now, my first blowjob, I probably don't remember. But I, I remember I the do. first time. Oh, Talk to, I see I've never asked that. <laughs> I do. What happened with your first blowjob? Uh, was it memorable? It was that memorable? It was good. good. That girl was a fucking artist, which was scary. Because what? I'm like, how many times has she done this? Yeah. Because we were fucking like freshmen. Damn, was she biting you or what? Nah, she was just an artist at it. It where, was what, like, where was this I was mesmerized. Where was this An at? artist? Yeah, she was stroking Damn. she was stroking my brush like a motherfucker. You oh, know what yeah. I mean? Where was it But at? this is the thing. Where did this happen at, dog? My homeboy, his his parents, they had like some friends. Those friends left the state. To, they went on vacation, so they said, "Hey, take care of our house." So my homeboy's dad was like, "Why don't you fucking tell his son? Why don't you take care of their house for while they're gone? I ain't gonna be hanging out at their fucking house." But they only live like two blocks away. So he was like, "Hey, that's the new party pad for like a week till they get back." At your homie's house, because so it was like. The homie's dad's friend's house. But the pad was all fucking free Yeah, game it was for, all free for, game. For like a week. Yeah, it was free. Wait a as- minute, wait a minute. You say your homie's... Friend's house. Friend's dad's house? You guys... God damn. Yeah, it's kind of weird, but yeah, but yeah something like okay, that. I mean, okay. Yeah, we, we, gotta, we, get, we go in depth in our stories here because we got to fucking... You got to understand one thing. Yeah. When you have a dumb audience as dumb as ours... Oh, they're fucking You got to break shit down to the molecule, bro. Yeah, You all can't just down. tell them something... They have no common sense for one. You can't say you made a bean and cheese burrito without telling without them. Without telling them how, what kind of tortilla, <laughs> yeah. who made the masa. Where the be- be- beans come from. Yeah, so that's our just. Are they from the olla? Are they from the can? You for real. I mean? Okay, so you're at that fucking pad. So what happens? Well, is everybody's ditching school. <laughs> yeah, well, we ended up meeting some chicks from a different school one day walking home. And we told we told them, hey, why don't you guys come by later? We're going to have beers and shit. You know, we'll kick back, have a little kickback. Well, only one of them showed up. Out of the two high knots? Yeah. And a bunch of fucking chorizos? <laughs> no, no, just me and my homeboy and then right. that, that chick. Oh, so both of you guys wanted to get laid. Yeah, well, we were trying to fucking tag team back again. You know what I mean? Check so. in the wreck and let's begin. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. How old are you guys? We're freshmen in high, high school. Oh, man. So we're like, what, 15? Something like that? Damn, I thought chorizo 14, had fried his brain essence. <laughs> yeah. So then what ended up happening was she... Was I guess closer to me because I was more funnier and I was more outgoing. And you so, you were a, so you were the class clown. Yeah, that's what, you're yeah, to that's say. what it was. And you had a nice mustache. Yeah. So you know, I, I want to ride that mustache. And this is crazy. Thing. My homeboy kept telling me because he shave, let, shave that shit, fool. Uh-huh. They're not gonna like it. <laughs> no, she, he was telling me he let me because back then in the nineties everybody was wearing like Raiders and Los Angeles Kings and all that shit, right? The black and white bullshit. Yeah. yeah. So he let me borrow one of his Raiders shirts that he just got. And he goes, look, don't fuck all day. This is all he keeps saying. This don't is the fuck. one Ice Cube has on the cover, carnal. Don't <laughs> uh-huh. fuck it up like you no, did your Ben like, Davis shirt. Don't don't fuck up my fucking my shirt, bro, no matter what. So when that chick finally showed up and we were drinking with her, and I told her, hey, you want to go in the room with me? She's like, yeah. And I was surprised. Like, what the fuck? And while we're walking to the room, there was like a long hallway. We were walking to the parents' room. I didn't know it was the parents' room till we got to that. You I just, just wanted to get as far away from the living room where this other vato was at. God damn, how big was his house? <laughs> yeah, God like, damn, was he a millionaire? What the fuck? He's always on the east corner. <laughs> God. Are you, he's on like the east corner. Con- God the- damn, by getting to the room, I'll be tired. Yeah. Dude. He was he's like, on, we're, on the, we're on the Concord floor, <laughs> left level. He was like, Chorizo, could you please use the room in the west wing? <laughs> <laughs> And then, <laughs> man, you so, need, it's on like you need a passport going that house. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, this my dick be you. already fucking gone. So, my boner be, oh, be too tired. Be too so, tired. This would be, this, this would be sleeping on the hallway by then. <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> get me a car and drive me to the damn room. So, we get to the fucking room. And we're sitting on the bed just bullshitting. And was she it a waterbed essay? No, nah, it wasn't a waterbed. Right. It was a big-ass fucking bed. Like a hey, big fool, one. I drove by a fucking store. 
Yeah. It's a waterbed store. Who the fuck buys waterbeds that they can dedicate a whole waterbed store? Yeah, Man, that's sad. I saw water it today. bids. Yeah, that's that's Man, from you're the talking 80s. 70s. <laughs> Fuck 80s, 70s, dude. There's a water bed store coming out. Fucking water bed. Water bed. I didn't know they make those motherfuckers yeah, anymore. They don't. Yeah, for real. Damn. So you go in the room. You guys yeah, finally in, make it. Yeah, fucking, we finally make it after like fucking monkey the bars. Detour, you guys yeah. like we fu- finally get there, and this girl's like. Now serving C twenty two at win number nine. <laughs> oh, she was sucking all kinds of air gas or what? Nah, oh. we just get to when we start bullshitting, yeah, and she tells me, "That sounds like the DMV over there." <laughs> <laughs> so she's like, "She's like, hey, you ever had a blowjob?" And I told her, "Nah, nah." And but she's I like, play with balloons. No, she was, so she goes, "For real?" And I'm like, "No, I never had." She goes, "Okay, check this out. Go bring me a bowl of ice." Ooh. Now I don't know what the fuck. Now already, we all know where we're headed with this. Yeah, now it sounds like a fiesta. I'm just a, now I'm, I'm just some dumb a what? kid. A, a oh. bowl of ice. So the I'm sitting there like a fucking dumb kid thinking, oh maybe she's thirsty. I don't know. Like what the fuck? She yeah, why she want ice? ice? Yeah. Fucking, you bought her a fucking cooler. Yeah. So I go and I get the bowl of ice. This vato's like, hey, what's going on, bro? Did you fuck her? Already? I'm like, motherfucker, we barely got to down the down the hallway to the room. How the fuck did I fuck fucking her? Fucking at the West Wing. Well, damn, dude. <laughs> it took us fucking four days to get there. You are freshmen. Yeah. You're not a Casanova. Yeah. So I get her her fucking bowl of ice. We're just sitting there rapping, you know what I mean? Just bullshitting. This was and, all freestyling. And she's all battling. Just, she's just putting, so you have a she's just putting ice tool. in her mouth. She's just putting Ooh. ice in her mouth. And what then she the? starts fucking touching me down there and gets me really. I'm already Ooh. stiff as fuck, but she's trying to go nuts. She goes, just lay back. Relax and, she goes, and enjoy the show. No man. matter what happens. You're going to love this. She says, never forget me. Yeah, anymore. she goes, don't fucking. She told me, to, don't bust in my mouth. Ooh. And then in my head, I'm thinking, oh, my gosh, she's going to suck my dick. Right? Yeah. Oh, my God, I'm going to get a blowout. Oh, my God, I'm tripping out. So I'm being cool. I'm like, I'll be like, why are you putting the ice yeah. in your mouth? Like, so, God damn. It feels good. Oh, man, it was the oh, best yeah. feeling in the whole world, ice bro. Ice blowjobs feel great. Oh, my gosh. It's so like, my first one was like the best. Was she Eskimo? No, nah, she, she was a Chicana. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, yeah. She must be part Eskimo. <laughs> Chicanos don't do that shit. That's, That's that why. Goes, That's why it's her memorable. Her dad goes to 7-Eleven a lot. They yeah. those big wolves. There's a lot of ice laying around yeah. the she house. She had a tattoo of a fucking penguin on her neck and shit. Hey, so that blowjob was fucking oh, delish. Oh, it was amazing. So she kept telling me, don't bust in my mouth. Because, like, she felt me move. Like, your body. Oh, you're, you're about. Like, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you're just like, oh, my God. And she stopped. Because the vein, the vein gets thick full of the yeah. little the dick vein. So she stopped. When you're about to bust, it's gonna, yeah. it inflates. And they, so, feel it, they feel it in their tongue. Yes, <laughs> Don't ask me. I know this, Holmes. <laughs> so I'm squirming. What and she'll, she'll stop fuck? in the middle. And she's like, don't fucking bust in my mouth. I'm like, okay. And then she'll just keep going. And then throw another ice cube in her mouth and keep Ooh, going. And that then, sounds fucking Don't delish. bust in my mouth. She kept telling me. I fucking unloaded in that fucking boca, bro. You have to, fool. Did she fucking get pissed? Oh, she fucking pulls it out, and it goes all over that Raiders shirt I'm wearing. <laughs> yeah, all over that motherfucker, bro. Like a spider web. <laughs> all over the place, right? Yeah, so she. Pinch spider, man. She wasn't a swallower? Nah, not at all. But still, I'm like, well, I'm she's not complaining. Nice yeah, yeah, yeah not but she, had her, she, had her she wasn't glands. a swallower, but she put ice in her mouth. Hey, yeah, she knew what's up. Yeah, she, I, I, she knew what's up, but she didn't know. What's I wouldn't up. complain, what Holmes. The? No, I'm, I'll never complain. I'll Wherever never complain. she's at, I miss you, Mika. Oh, yeah, <laughs> you know what I mean? Mar- Marisol. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't know what her Email name me was. Email Mika. <laughs> Lisette, I don't know what her name was. Lisette, I don't know her name, Holmes. My email address is. I seen her. We're freshmen. I seen her a year later at a bus. That's stop. sick. You just said I seen her. <laughs> like, I I seen her. Put on yellow. I seen her Dad, yellow. That's what's up. I, I seen her. <laughs> Did you hear that? Oh, am I tripping yeah. already? I heard God that. God damn, toward the friends, motherfucker got me fucking. <laughs> hey, got you all fucking so twisted. Got me homes. thinking. He's saying, I've. I see. <laughs> <laughs> Man, did you, did you yeah, hear that? I heard it. Yeah. Boy, I'm gonna rewind the tape just so he could hear it too. So check it. this out. I'm at a bus stop on Seventh Street in Roosevelt. That bus stop's still there, Holmes. Probably. She's there. She acts like she don't know me. Cause I haven't seen her after that. After she gave me the the, the best thing in the world, oh, I didn't she, see her after that. She pretended she didn't know you. Yes, yeah, so I was like, "Hey, what's up? What's up?" She's acting like she didn't know me. Because I just seen her from behind. She said, I blew this ugly motherfucker. Yeah, so she turns. She's all regretting life. So I'm shit. like, all right, then we'll fucking I keep acting like that. I don't give a fuck. Fuck it. I don't care. 
And then she turned to like mad dog me, and she fucking had a big old pancha. She was pregnant, bro. Oh shit! Yeah, she's sixteen and pregnant. No bullshit. You got lucky then. I was like, oh my god. Yeah. Busted her mouth, not her fucking chon. Yeah. But she did want me to smash again. No, that night I didn't smash it. Why not? She wanted me to. Okay. This is gonna sound real stupid, but at the time you were a fan of Green Day and you weren't a fan of the smashing pumpkin. (laughs) No, No, at the time this is what, bro. I'm being honest with you. Okay. Don't cry, this, Holmes. No, no. Don't cry, Holmes. It's all right. Why? It's the all chick, right, Pancho Villa. A couple okay, of chicks. Okay. A couple of chicks before this chick. I thought gave me gonorrhea. Oh, that's what I thought. Oh. So I thought th- because in school they said if you go urinate and it, you feel a burning sensation, that means you got the clap. You got gonorrhea. And right? you're fucking pissing at a. Well, I pissed and I thought because I wasn't drinking a lot of water. And it was just warm, like regular, like when you just piss and it's warm. But to you, I thought that's what the teacher meant by burning, right? So I just went in the room and I told my mom, I was like, hey, my it burns when burning? it, yeah, it burns when I pee. And she's like, the fuck? she got up, she's like four foot one, right? She gets up, she goes, you son of a bitch, your fucking ass starts beating the shit out of me, bro. I'm like oh, way taller fuck. than her. She goes crazy, okay? She goes fucking nuts. So your mom starts beating the shit out of you? Yeah, she starts beating the shit out of you. Because <laughs> she told her you got gonorrhea. Well, I didn't say that, but, you know, she put no, two she and two together. because this dude's fucking. Fucking, and I'm her only son. Age. I'm her only son. And he's a freshman. Yeah. Doing that's icicle basically. shit. <laughs> yeah, you know, that's this dude's it. getting crazy. I'm going nuts. Man, just so, fucking everybody getting all the. Getting yeah, all the. All the goodness. All the claps. All the claps. All the, all the, claps, all the gonorrhea. <laughs> all the syphilis. All the fucking. Save some for crabs. the rest of us. God put the He's hogging up all the diseases, man. <laughs> Fuck. There's still a couple of crabs fucking hanging on his speak. Man, thing. bro. He's greedy. <laughs> You're like a disease thief. <laughs> <laughs> Don't give nobody a break. <laughs> but, hey, you can have that shit. <laughs> you can have that shit. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. Oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, so after, <laughs> so after your mom whoops your ass, what happens? This so she takes me the next day. <laughs> hey, that was a good one, Ghost. I ain't going to bullshit you. That was good. I that was that. good. The next day, she takes me to the free clinic. <laughs> so, yeah, hey, we're poor. Fool, she ain't going to pay a doctor. She fuck takes me no. to the free clinic. Yeah, right? just to check on your fucking wounds, huh? <laughs> and then take you to fucking... <laughs> <laughs> and they took it with disease clinic. <laughs> After, she's like, hey, bandages these putos up so it doesn't look like I just beat the fuck out of him for like that, 45 and minutes. And I'm going to take him next door to get his free STD <laughs> test. Yeah. Penicillin. So, uh, we'll kill everything. Hell yeah, they give you one. Now it's just so, one. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be good in five days. Don't fucking five days, mijo. Hey, so check this out. They tell me to go. I go inside the fucking clinic. They sit me in a room and they have me watching all these videos of people with Warts on their fucking War, warts on Love their nuts. You. They got fucking shit dripping off their dicks. Their dicks look like oh, like super like, like S- crazy videos. STD pito. Yeah. So they had me watching videos of that shit, slides and shit, to scare me, right? But I'm already scared because I'm thinking, fuck, I got something because I'm fucking it burns when I pee. That's what I'm just thinking. So they get a Q-tip. One of the nurses comes in, gets a Q-tip. It was the doctor. That's gets how they Q-tip. for that shit? Yeah, they get a Q-tip. The yeah. They put it in this gel. It looks like hair gel. And they stick it in your dick hole. In your urethra? They go in there, too. They don't fuck around, bro. You want to cry. It hurts. It feels like they're sticking a piece of glass in for there. For chlamydia? For gonorrhea. Fuck? For anything, because whatever you have is inside the urethra, like the walls of the urethra. So Wait, imagine like oh, the walls of your dick. Hey, yeah. Cool. Now you just piss in the cup, homie. Well, no, I know that's you know, but oh. this was like in the early nineties. Yeah. Now you just piss it like, the cup hey, and you're pop good. this hey, here. Yeah. Take there's twenty dollars. Yeah. Then you're now the that 20, you piss in the cup, they, they put a, a little, stick in it and whatever. They give you a little pill. Into. You take it. They're like, don't fuck for five days, mijo. Yeah. Come get tested again in five days just to make sure you could keep fucking. Damn, that's so the future pills, huh? They oh yeah, a pill. Yeah, cure you. Pills. Oh. Hey, for you could live with HIV a normal life now. With yeah, the, with all if the you have HIV, you're if you good. have HIV, you're good. Cure already, huh? It's not yeah. cure, but, Ma- but they you... still call it the Magic Johnson. Disease? Yeah, they still call, they call it, the, it Magic the Magic Johnson, Johnson potion. That's so that yeah. keeps you alive. If you oh, got the feria, right. yeah. If you got oh, money, so you gotta have money to live. Yeah. You ever watch the South Park episode? No. no. Where fucking you got? It's about Magic Johnson. Like, yeah, he he his, he cured his AIDS because he has money. 
And all he's doing is injecting money into his veins and shit. Oh, he was? I thought that was fucking funny. Because he has money. I think okay. there's a cure for everything. You just got to have the money, like you said. Yeah. Well, yeah. A cure for everything. It's just, a, it's just a fucking way to make more money. It is. That's all. Damn, so did that Q-tip hurt? Fuck yeah, it hurt, bro. Were you screaming? No, I, was, I didn't scream, but I was like... Did you want up. to? I wanted to fucking punch that fucking bitch in the face, Oh, as a girl? Yeah, well, I don't want to do touch. Hey, you four, I'm, drinking three, three, touch I'm drinking three How different drinks, I said. I was like 15. Oh, okay. So... Yeah, freshman. Yeah, so check this out. Um... So you didn't have it? Well, yeah, they ended up checking it and they told me that I didn't have it, but... You probably did they that gave fucking bunk-ass test they So gave there was you? a good thing about this whole thing. The good thing was... They, they give you a shitload of condoms? Yeah, they give you a little brown bag full of rubbers when you leave. Keep fucking, mijo. So the whole time we are in high school... Come on, champ. We just go like... We tell one of our friends, hey, stop at the clinic, fool, before we go to that party and, have, and, get, a, and get a little and fucking they a bolsa. Bowl, huh? They have a bowl? Oh, nah, that bag there? It was a little brown bag, so nobody knew what you had in your hand. Oh, the one by our house? full of rubbers. The one by our house had a... Yeah, bro. The one by our house had a... Kind of like a surprise? Yeah, it was just like a Latimo bag. You know what I mean? Like, boom, here you go, mijo. Fucking oh, Latimo? Fuck Who's Latimo? So, we used to stop by. Oh, it's a show here in yeah. Arizona. So, we used to stop Back by the as the years went by. 80s, yeah. 70s. What was and it? And we used to just go to the clinic and the get a... The Latimo show. Yeah. Wallace and Latimo. Wallace and Latimo. You guys used to watch that? Yeah, I did. I watched it like a motherfucker every morning. Dude, I always wanted one of those fucking bags. bags. I know it's full of toys and dulces and shit. For real? But yeah. I never, I never got one. Like what kind I, of? I oh shit! We're having a, a wa- fucking. I wanted we're a, a sad moment. Sad moment. Moment fucking bag, bro. What was yeah. inside the bag? Like toys. Whoppers. And- I remember that they always say whoppers, and I'm on like wonder. Oh, the yeah, the, 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 the little chocolate. Yes. yes. Yeah. Whoppers. Whoppers. They had toys. Had a soda in that motherfucker. Yeah, toys. Chips. Yeah, everything in that motherfucker. Magazine. And when you're a little books. kid, if you're a little kid and you run the show, everybody got a lot more bag. And what they film it here in Phoenix? Yeah, it was here yeah, in Phoenix. Arizona. News Channel Five. You guys never went. You guys were never part of. The- Somebody in my family went. And they but, got the bag? Yeah, but this was in the early 70s. What, you throw it in your went? face? Look, puto. <laughs> uh, but the bag back then. Your mom hates you, puto. <laughs> the bag back then, they told me, was a regular size grocery bag. Oh, back in the So in when the I big... was watching it, they were like, the bags are all little now. The bags ain't as fucking big as they used what, to be. What were they? Like sandwich bags? They were like, like that big. Yeah, like, like, like sandwich that, like bags. That. And they would have Wallace. Like what would it have in the front? It says in the front, it said Latimo. Ba- La- Latimo. Yeah, Latimo. Latimo bag. So, yeah. Yeah. So Latimo, Latimo was bag, Latimo was a tall, skinny vato. The other one was short, fat. And what was the show about? Like just it was just like, like, like random cartoons. Tunes, they like play cartoons and they come back to the show and, and talk and do stupid shit. They would have like a cartoons. they would have like a clown dude come yeah. out. Yeah, they have like a little stuck up kid. Kid, come yeah, out. but it was a grown up kind of like but a chapel grown up. Uh, like yeah. a, what did the stuck yeah, up kid yeah. do? Like oh, he was yeah. just being, he was being a, yeah, he was a dick. Yeah, <laughs> like a skin. But it was a yeah. gro- he was a dick. He was a grown ass man. Acting bro, like a kid, like travel the No, but they would have like guests on the show. Yeah, they have guests on the show. Guests on the show, dude. So. Yeah, dude, the, the the little snotty kid would go in and talk shit to the little. And this was what, like in the, the what was this, the eighties or nineties? Yeah, yeah man, this you're looking like early eighties. No, early eighties. I used to yeah. watch it in the early eighties. Man, I dude, I still remember. I used the to song. love watching it. Remember the song, the beginning of the, the show. You, how is the it? You guys got to You guys got to sing it. Oh man, come I'm, on, give it to we me. We gotta guys. Google it, man. We gotta, oh, we gotta hear yeah, it. You remember? It? Yeah, no, I don't remember. I don't remember. They even used to go to this. They shit, who's barking? Shut up, Rambo. All right, go for. They used to go where? There was this. You know where the Phoenix Zoo is? Yeah. By the Phoenix Zoo before it was the fucking Phoenix Zoo. Hey, they were at the fairs too. Oh yeah, yeah. They used to go to the fair, but there was this place. Oh, right over here, there. the the, yeah. the state fair. Yeah, they there was were a around, place over dude. there called uh, Wallace Aladdin. I don't know so. if you remember this. There was a place called Legend City back there, over there by where the Phoenix Zoo is. Legend and City. It was called Legend City. Now nobody who's listening to this fucking podcast is gonna know any of this shit. You could Google it, though. There's pictures of it online. And it was like a little carnival that was like a Western carnival that was always there. It was like a permanent spot. Hidden. Like just, yeah, way the fuck over right there. there. in the corner. Wallace and I are up next, and we have lots of cartoons and fun stuff. So don't miss it here on TV5. Told you, TV5. Yeah, yeah that's it there right there. Go. Yeah. The Wallace and Landmo show. That's it. Oh, yeah, that was it. Oh, shit. <laughs> that was it, bro. Oh, man. Crazy, crazy. Memories, this memories. Like, they're coming out of his head. Oh, oh, ah, ah, ee, ee, ah, ah, 
Hey, all my exes live in Texas. Oh, yeah, they're chilling with little kids. Yeah. They're just kicking Oh, that the boy, Captain Super. Captain Super, Oh, yeah, man. yeah, yeah, yeah. Captain, Captain Super. Super. Oh, it was like, they did skits? Yeah, they yeah, did like they did little, little skits. They were like little, yeah, yeah. little kid skits. There's like a viejita with glasses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That would like. Yeah, and one has like little yeah. freckles. One looks like you're flat, like one's skinny and tall. With the red shirt, with some ruffles in the front. Yeah. Damn, does yeah, that bring back glasses? Oh, does man. that bring back memories oh, or what? That yeah, little bro. song? Man. Yeah, hell yeah. You know it what, does. dude? Now that I'm getting older, I'm always like, all my favorite characters ever, like, man, they're dying off. Like, yeah. fucking, they're gone, bro. You know? It was fun. Man. It was a big deal back then. While this in Latimer? Yeah, it was a big deal. This is a crazy thing. And I didn't know this until like 10 years ago, okay? Downtown Phoenix, they have a boxing museum for boxers that were from AZ. Where's this at? I want to go. It's still there. It's on. It's free. You could just walk in there where and just at? check it out. That's tight. I want to go check okay. that out. Okay. You know where that fucking McDonald's is right there on fucking Van Buren and 7th Ave? Yeah. Go across the street from that McDonald's and the, you'll where, see it. Where the, right car, the car wash is at? Well, not on that side, but the other side. Okay. Like southwest. Okay. Southwest. Okay, okay. Okay. Yeah, it's a boxing museum. That's fucking dope. I never even knew about yeah, that. Yeah, I didn't know either. And they built it. So I'm in there and I'm walking around because one of the boxing coaches that I know. Yeah. I was talking to him about Wallace and Lattimore. And he's like, yeah, man, you know, uh, Wallace was a real good boxer in the day. And I was like, what do you mean he was a boxer? He's like, bro, he was a fucking boxer that we used to throw down. And like, well, he's a fat tub of shit. What are you talking about? He's like, no, nah, man, not back then. And he's in that fucking museum, bro. Oh, he's in the Hall His of Fame? His picture's in there, bro. That fucking... That was to throw one thing. You know fu- what I mean? That's fucking dope, bro. And then Wallace? We, yeah, Wallace was a fucking badass boxer, apparently. First Dang. of all, first of all, Ghost, we got to go hit that museum of Get Stone. Yeah, go check it out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I would love to go see who... who yeah, yeah, go, go check out... Yeah, who represented yeah, Arizona. Represent you know what I mean? To yeah. the fullest. To yeah. the fullest. Mm-hmm. In the gloves. I like that gym in, on Van Buren, how it has all the fucking photos outside. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's pretty cool. The murals and, and shit. And you say it's free to get in? Yeah, it's just like a... It's not that big. It's like a... But just still, a, it's still cool to yeah, go check it cool out. Yeah, it's still cool because you see... Fuck yeah. Because I'm, I'm... What re- is it? Like, just, like plaques re- and yeah, shit? Yeah, it's just plaques and pictures and what years and all that. And you're reading about them, like paper clipping, newspaper clippings and shit. It was yeah, cool, Yeah, I got to go, dude. I, I gotta was go like, to that shit. what the fuck? I didn't even know this was here. And you Wallace I mean? was a fucking boxer. Yeah, now. Wallace used to knock motherfuckers out. Next thing you know, he's giving kids fucking candies. You know what I mean? So he Man, was a cool vato. You know I what I'm saying? I still want a Lambo bag. <laughs> <laughs> Check out Ghost over here. You got to let it go. Oh, we thought. Fucking dude. Ghost is on eBay right now I trying to find one. I want a Lambo bag. Man, I want one of those Whoppers and <laughs> soda. And <laughs> so chips. Some chips. Hey, so zigzag. Hey, those, those would seem like they were fucking cool as fuck then. Yeah, yeah, they were cool. They were funny or what? Like, yeah, well, well, you know, you're a little kid, so yeah, it was hilarious yeah, to you. Fuck, yeah. I don't want to watch a show now and then get all mad. Man. Yeah, don't watch it now. <laughs> yeah. But that, that theme song was pretty dope. Yeah, was funny. And the bad thing, I didn't have a phone. You could call and you could win a Lambo back, but I don't have yeah. a fucking phone. Oh, yeah, you could yeah. win and call. And yeah. You could call in. You had like a certain. Yeah. You could win a Lambo back. You could win a Lambo back. Oh, damn. You didn't have a phone? Yeah, you would have a phone. And, and if you were the caller, you would win a Lambo, Lambo back. back. Damn. But I didn't have a phone. You grew yeah. up in Phoenix, Ghost? Nah, in the outer skirts, the yeah. outer skirts. I was born in Phoenix, but in the outer skirts when I was younger, when the Lamo shit was happening. You were yeah. on the outer skirts? Fuck, in the outer skirts where there wasn't no phones. Yeah. When did you move to Phoenix? Like, what fucking era? Do you remember? Fuck. When they burned my fucking restroom. Let's take shits outside. Bro. They burned your restroom? Yeah, yeah. dude. Fucking hey, burning I don't miss restroom. that. I used to have to do that, too. I hate those uh, fucking... Like an outhouse? Out- yeah. yeah, like a hut yeah. house. It was an outhouse. Yeah, house. dude, a hut. Yeah. 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 Fuck, fuck yeah, fuck bro. Yeah, dude. And I used to hate it in the winter time because I freed my balls off just to go take a shit. Yeah, I'm fucking running out. Small, small town, to, man. Hey, but to piss, small you just open the door. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it sucked. Yeah, fuck. Oh, damn, that's crazy. People I thought don't it understand, be, bro. Nah, I don't, dude. I thought it should only happen in Mexico. I, no, bro, people don't understand. Mm. When people like talk to me about shit, and I always tell other people, like, you guys are fucking spoiled. Even if I would explain to them why I tell them that, they'll never get it because they never had to live through it. Yeah, I, exactly. You, know what I mean? you never get like, it you'll never you're there. get it. You know? Until you're there, until you're part of it. That's okay, it. real quick, let me jump back to when I was at the clinic. Oh, yeah. So I can yeah, finish yeah, that yeah, story. No, no, you're good. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Okay, yeah, so yeah, check yeah, this out. Yeah, that was yeah, a great yeah, story. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so 
I'm scared now to bang without a condom, right? Like no matter what, no matter what, no, not now, but at the time. <laughs> I'm hoping like, that happened. This was been right? married for like 35 <laughs> years. Like, what do you mean you're scared? That's it. So as far as yeah, like, don't six, you got like five? Before like six kids, yeah. fucking seven, seven wives, kids, eight kids. What's this so, was what, this was Muslim. What, what, ten kids? So when I got with that chick that I fucking spewed all over the Raiders shirt, yeah, she wanted me to hit it. I kept telling her no because I don't have a condom. But yeah, she just fucking gave me the craziest my of my life. But like you, I could have got it either way. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, but she was um. Fertile, dude. Yeah, you would have so got her pregnant that yeah. night. Yeah, so I'm kind of glad it didn't happen. That's your fucking. But it was just me being young and dumb, also. Like that's your father upstairs. Because then later you, on, all my friends were like, "You should have fucked her anyways. You you were already letting her fucking blow you. You should have just begged her anyways." And I was like, "Yeah, maybe I should have." They got you fucking rethinking your yeah, life. Yeah, I was thinking over the whole. Job. Yeah, I was rethinking about. I started going to church and shit. In, in my days, bitches fuck before they suck my dick. Yeah, they're, girl, <laughs> I, they'll give up the pussy before they before be they even suck a dick. Huh? Yeah, dude, come on, man. I'm all like, what the fuck? Yeah, this bitch bro. must have been a freak. Oh, <laughs> yeah, sucking she was. dick is second nature. Yeah, second nature. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you know what I mean. I ain't trying to be, you know. Yeah, no, this girl race or anything, but you know what I mean. What was she like? She was, Black, no, she was a right? Chicana. She was a Chicana. Man. What the? F- Straight up, bro. Hey, bro. She got to be mixed, bro. <laughs> she had to hey, be mixed. Real Mexican girls, they don't go straight for the dick, dude. Nah. Well, this one did. They, 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 these bitches be like, okay. it hurts. If, it, if it's, shit, if it's, you know? if it's, nah, any, if it's, she had to be mixed. <laughs> Talk to me. She kind of had the features in. of a native. So she was part native, maybe. Maybe she could have been. We'll give she you had it. those features. We'll just say she was, Chorizo, so you pussied out that night. <laughs> You know what I mean? Cause now there's a lot of Chicanas and Mexicans. They don't love to suck dick, dude. No, I know that. Man, I'm just those saying, girls, they think it's like you know. I shoved a couple it's of in the Bible, dude. It's in down. the Bible, dude. You know they don't mean? like to suck dick. Dude. It's in the Bible. They don't suck dick, but they'll fucking ride your fucking mustache like a fucking wild hog. Yes, <laughs> hey, they Man, love like said, it. Oh, e- every girl fucking wants you to fucking tongue dive that fucking. Yeah, everybody wants you to be fucking mixed, tongue dude. punch that fucking brown box. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Anyways, yeah. hey, so I don't see it. Hey, ghost. Hey, ghost. I want to know if you ever chili dog the girl. What the fuck? You ever heard of a chili dog? I never heard of a chili. Go dog. ahead, Tolo. Break it down. It's when you shit on the girl's fucking chest and then you titty fuck her, Holmes. It's like a chili dog. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. You ever done that? Oh, hey guys, man, you guys. That. If a girl wanted you to do oh, that, I, would you on. do it? Can I ask you guys a question? If a girl wanted me to shit on her. And then titty fucker. I don't know if it'll be a chili dog, but it'll be a log dog. <laughs> <laughs> you know oh, what I'm saying? You can't, hey, I, you, I don't got the squirts. Hey, yeah. <laughs> hey Ghost will confuse it for his dick. He don't know if it's a cerote or his fucking dick. Yes, I don't give a fuck. I ain't hitting my chin. <laughs> hitting her chin. No. Shit. It'll be hitting more than just that, homie. Yeah, we don't, we don't fuck with chili dog. We just throw log hey, dogs. Hey, Ghost is fucking crazy over here when he said, Damn, Judy, it sounds like you're a, a disease thief. <laughs> hey, man. I just see it. Hey, I need to piss, call homies. You guys keep it going, hey, homies. No, we always keep it going, bro. We keep it Think flowing. about a question to ask me while I get back, home. All right, oh, go man. ahead, Dolo. Go ahead and do your thing, bro. Damn, that's all right, keep, 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 keep yeah, going with your story. Keep going with your story. Keep going with your story. So, that was my first time, but it wasn't my last. I've had a few biters in my day. What about you, Ghost? Ooh, no got, biter? Oh, I got biters? You never had one that just fucking kind of scraped it with her fucking molars and shit? Man, I'm always getting scratched, dude. <laughs> oh, fucking man. I swear, dude. They don't, they don't, can't do it right. Yeah. Some of them are just rookies at it, bro. They, you got to coach them. You got to fucking. Man, they're all scrapers. <laughs> they're all That's scrapers. what I call them, scrapers. <laughs> they be scraping like a what shit. What about you, Tolo? Yeah, you ever man. had a scraper? Yeah, but allegedly I heard that fucking. <laughs> hookers give the best mamonas because they got it, they got all the practice well, in the fucking, fucking world. That's your that's God, their profession. Damn, hookers. Man. Wait a minute. Hey, I've Ghost, never had you ever, Hey, Ghost, you Ghost. never been with a hooker? Hell no. I, that's one thing they always told me. Pussy and water is free, homie. Damn. I don't fuck around. This fool got more. I don't got to pay for that shit. Damn. You got more on, morals. Man. Than Ghost is over here taking water from a manguera. I fool just filling <laughs> up a bottle of water. Hey, Ghost is over here Pussy fucking. Pussy water's pu- free, America. 
Joseph's like, over here fuck. preaching knowledge hey, to us. Hey. 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 I gotta rethink my life. Holmes. I do too, Holmes. I don't know. Have you guys fucking paid for pussy? Hey, bro, yeah, I'm not even wrong. Wait a You're minute. You're talking to the Roach Clip podcast. Of course we Dude, have. we paid for everything, Holmes. Yeah. <laughs> Should we pay for this beer? We usually just steal it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. I paid for pussy in my day. Why yeah. not? Oh, why it. not, you bro? Gotta, you got to try some skank once in a yeah. while. Oh, some you know strange. I mean? some, strange. some strange. Some skank. Yeah. Okay. I mean, okay. it's crazy. A, it it might have ha- allegedly happened once or twice. <laughs> I might have got jacked hey, once or twice. You, <laughs> <laughs> you got catfish. Yeah, I got catfish. Uh, I got catfish. Did you? Well, remember episode three? I got catfish. Quick, yeah. Run, run it down what's real quick. Give us a ten. Give us a recap. Give us a recap. The recap. the recap. What the fuck, bro? Give when I pop a bottle, like, it's with the model. You give, know me the, I mean? give me the, te- <laughs> give me the, te- <laughs> <laughs> give me the ten second version, home. The ten second version is that this chick that I was talking to on the oh, phone. Oh, chorizo. Yeah. Chorizo. You took her to Cir- uh, Kmart. Yeah, the glamour yeah, shot. Yeah, all right, that one. Yeah. This so one, fucking yeah, this, it was crazy, bro. I got catfish. Dude. I got catfish hard. You ever, you ever been catfish? Cause you I, never been catfish? Go catfish. Yeah. Let me see. Nah, I never been catfish. What about the lapia? <laughs> stir fry, stir fry. <laughs> stir, Ooh, fry. So stir fry does sound bomb Man, right now. Stir hey, Vic, fry, homie. hey Vic, have you ever had to go to the clinic because you thought you had something? Man. Yeah, I went and I did have something, Holmes. No, but did you really? Or are you yeah. fucking around? I had the clapit. The, they did cl- <laughs> The clapit. The clap. <laughs> El aplauso. <laughs> El aplauso. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was famous, Holmes. <laughs> I'm a oh, damn. You sound over. like an artist. <laughs> <laughs> El aplauso is <laughs> coming out. Yeah, for the fucking encore and shit. Every time he stepped into the it's, bedroom. Hey, fool. It's, it's not as glamorous as it sounds, Holmes. Look, everybody's all quiet. El Paso just uh, Yeah, but they just gave me. They just, gave just me, entered the room. Yeah, they just gave me a pill. An old clapper. Hey, fool, but they didn't fucking know Q-tip or not that way. What did they do to you, bro? I just pissed, and they're like, wait, like, fucking 10 minutes, sir. And they're like, yeah, you got it. Like, yeah, you got it. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be like, I got what? What the fuck? I well, got it. No, well, she explained. Like, she's like, sir, come in. She's like, can you sit down? She's like, you got chlamydia. And then she's like, you can't get it from eating pussy. You can't get it from this. You can't get it from that. The only way you can get it is from fucking... Fucking, fucking a girl hookies. from fucking a hooker in the fucking booty hole with no condom. Damn. She no. said that? No, she said you can't get it from blowjobs or from eating a girl out, but you could get it from just just from fucking without a rubber. So can you like, get can you get it. stuff from eating a girl out? I don't know. I didn't ask. I didn't go that. Far. I was just happy, fool. In my head, I was like, "Fuck, that's all I got." Thank you, God. And then yeah, she gave me this pastilla. Yeah, she's like, "Pop this fucking pill, sir." Yeah. I think like wait five, 15 days. wait five days or so. Yeah, I, don't, I forgot the <laughs> amount. Yeah, five days. It used to be yeah. It was it wasn't that long. Uh, it was yeah, like oh. it was like a week or some shit. Well, they got yeah. a super 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 killer right and there. And they told me to go back in to test myself, but I really I did I didn't do that part. Yeah. I was like, I should be good. I waited the seven days, and then I went back on fucking. Backpage.com Nah <laughs> You went on fucking Backroom casting Dude. couches back <laughs> You went back to No strings attached <laughs> I was like fucking <laughs> These fucking bitches dude, I swear Hey dude No strings attached I'm happily married oh. I have a home But I wanna suck your dick No, no strings attached Fucking bitches dude. Hey there is crazy bitches Like that bro No hell yeah bro They're nuts Oh man, I don't understand. Or you got this, these chicks understand. that just call a vato over while their old man's at work. Hey, bro. I had What's a up? homie that went to fucking jail. No, Wait a minute. Hey, no joke, fool. Wait a minute. What's up, homie? You be saying like you're the only dude that has a homie that went to jail. <laughs> well, all a, my fucking friends are in jail. My, my real friends. I, uh, <laughs> all my exes live in Texas, SM. Shout okay, out so, to everybody's locked hey, up right now. This vato got locked up <laughs> and like fucking. Twelve hours later, his hyena was uh, knocking at my door, fool, to go over to her fucking canton. They smashed. Dude, she had the biggest tetas you've ever seen in your life. Like no joke, fool. They were like this big. Wait a minute, they were bigger than fucking big titty mics. He, they were. Mm, that's good. That's that's probably. I got own, you right there. That's his only competition. Yeah. But other than that, fool, those balloons were fucking. <laughs> no mommy. So what happened? Him. Did you do your, what you had to do? Well, I went and then like fucking, she's all macking and shit. Yeah. And then she goes like, but. 
in order for me to sleep with you, like, you got to care about my kids, too. I was like, no, I fucking just did, bro. Yeah, yeah I, I, caring about, I don't even care about my so, fucking wevels. So, there, here's what happened, dude. How many kids did she have? God okay, damn. So <laughs> she had two or three. She lived in a shoe. Two or three? Hey, check this out. She lived in a shoe. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Hey, check this out! Like, fucking you didn't know that when you walked in the house. I know you didn't see all the fuck, fucking. I know you little... ran over some toys and shit walking in. <laughs> hey, fool! I was like, what the hell? I know is you on stepped on a fucking Lego. <laughs> yeah, fuck, I know you hey. stepped on a fucking muñeca. <laughs> So, I know when you pulled up to the house, there were like 15 big wheels parked in the front yard and shit. Two squeak sets, a fucking burnt up yanta, all kinds of shit. Sets of mystery was you playing You know you went shit. in her room and her bed was on the fucking floor. <laughs> you, know, you already you know that. Everybody. You already know that. <laughs> you know there was all kinds of empty fucking gogurts all over the fucking place. Is that shit coming loose, Chonis? Yeah, I'll tighten it up. Yeah, Sorry. there's like a little butterfly. <laughs> hey, hey, Tolo's acting like he didn't know she had 80 kids at all. But yeah, she's, damn, you know you walked into a, a shoe. Fu- you know you walked into a fucking daycare. It was like Tudor time and shit. <laughs> hey, she had the carpet on the floor with the racetrack and shit. <laughs> with the fucking ABCs and shit across. She had a bunch of mats on the floor to take nap times during the she day. Fucking, she tried to feed you with a fucking Hello Kitty spoon and shit. <laughs> she tried to give you a treat like a little kid. She tried to send you to bed. She was trying to give you a snack. Are you hungry? She told you if you listen to her, she'll put a gold star on your fucking report card. <laughs> she, she wanted to change your diaper. <laughs> like, damn, girl, I try to change my diaper. It's, it's, the fucking silly fan had little monitos on it so you could fucking get hypnotized when you're fucking laid on the floor. She's not putting me on a booster chair for dinner. <laughs> she wanted to breastfeed your ass. <laughs> She want to give you tea. Hey, she took off her bra. She already had another kid sucking on her other teta and shit. Uh, God damn. <laughs> what a pervert. <laughs> oh, shit. That's just hey, funny, so, bro. So you're happened? fighting for the titty? Uh, All right. So, so like, what ended up happening for you? like fucking six months later, <laughs> this bitch is pregnant, Holmes. Wait a minute. Stop. Collaborate and listen. You got her pregnant? Fuck no. What happened? I didn't fuck her. So six months later, she's pregnant. Those, that's how it happened. From her what? brother. From her brother. No, no, from her husband's brother. I say. So the dude so her got, brother-in-law? Yeah, her brother-in-law got her pregnant. Oh, this girl just like to fuck. Hey, motherfucker. If you're listening to this, why you get her pregnant, Holmes? Right into the podcast. Hey, so this girl just like to bang or what? Yeah, she fucked her. And that motherfucker, dude, is ugly, fool. What, but he looked like Woody what from Toy fuck? Story. So hey, the fool, kids all like them. You ain't never seen an ugly motherfucker like that in your life, fool. He was she like fine or what? He looked yeah, like Freddy yeah. Krueger, fool. And she she just wanted some vetter. Yeah, she just How wanted vetter. How did she vetter. look, though? How did she look? Like her face. She was fucking... I would give her like a 6 out of 10. Well, that ain't too Not bad. bad. God, the tetas were fucking 10s. Yeah. Oh. So that's what gave her the fucking... Probably that was like, fuck it, dude. My brother... My brother got... Because de- his brother got deported. Yeah. Two of his brothers got deported, dude. They're both in TJ right now as we speak. Yes, on this fucking microphone. And that girl with nationality. Shout, shout out she? to you fucking... To you... Uh, to you... Uh, what do you call it? Like TJ Rednecks? Because they're yeah. fucking each other's family members. Hey, but wait a minute. Let's back it up. Okay. What nationality was this female? This female was white. Oh, there you go. We're done with that conversation. We're done with that conversation. Yeah. We're already done. But I kind of, I'm upset with you not seeing the red flags while you were walking into the fucking house. Hey, there was a lot of them. Hey, but at the time, you don't give a fuck, dude. You You're, know what I mean? You know what I mean? You're like, she asked you, you wanted a beer, she gave it to you in a sippy cup. <laughs> <laughs> she had to do a titi and shit she, was, <laughs> she put a chupon in your mouth And she was fucking cradling your back and shit She wanted oh, to carry shit. you so she could burp you <laughs> She's like no Hey oh, she was asking you to carry She to burp you homie <laughs> Fuck That's fucked hey, up huh? I'm That's... telling you dude These daycare hey, you know These what? daycare moms are fucked up yeah. homie yeah, They try to crazy. pamper you like you're a fucking kid I homie. Know, man I wouldn't want nobody carrying She had you watching me. fucking Zoobly Zoo oh, and shit damn. Fuck bro Fucking Teletubbies <laughs> Watching Teletubbies, Barney. Yeah. Fuck, dude. Fucking Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. She kept tying her shoe and shit while you were looking at her. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so you were there macking with her. Things got kind of heavy. Did kinda... she let you fucking grab those bad boys? Oh, or? yeah, yeah. They were fucking heavy, dog. I'm telling you, heavy. Were you all over them? Those are Damn. the biggest titties I've ever seen in my life. What do you bro. mean? Wait, even, 
Jesus. Even comparing you. I don't even know. They were probably, probably like this, dog. What would you call these? Oh, man. I'll, I'll call that. I swear that, to God, I'll call those motherfuckers amazing. I'll what are you talking about? I'll call that alien. <laughs> I'll call that alien. You could just see her fucking eyes, dude. Fucking peeping out the fucking tetas. Oh, oh, yeah, those fuckers were out there, homie. So, she told you that, and then you got discouraged and left. Hey, bro. Yeah, I just balanced. Fuck that. Fuck that. With, hey, with the flat tire full oh, in my brother's car. Wait a minute, bro. First of all, I fucking that's forgot. That's I stopped the story. Yeah, I just remembered that when you Big said that. Big and a flat tire. Yeah, that yeah, don't make no smart. sense. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, I was in my brother's RX-7 full. And what happened? And I was like, fuck that. I'm driving back home, and that tire was flat. There's no way I'm gonna fucking chill there any a minute longer. I drive, fuck, dude. I drive that bitch home. Yeah. With the flat tire the whole way home, but I didn't live that far from that bitch. But yeah, the tire was fucking flat, carnal. She, she so she kind of scared you. Yeah, yeah, she scared me. She fool. said that. Yeah. Yeah. No, you know what it was, okay, bro. I'll be scared too. Titty. Yeah, that's that yeah. scared me. Too I, many I know what it was, bro. Too much titty, too many kids. This too is the part titties. you're leaving out. Talk to me, playboy. You asked her when she said you gotta accept me and you gotta love my kids. Yeah. You asked her how many kids and when she gave you the number. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. I was like, I could love one or Fucking two. Tolo, Tolo was like twenty seven. You know how many Christmas gifts I gotta buy? God <laughs> damn, they don't even have dollar stores. See, I, didn't, yeah, I didn't even Fuck. think about dollar stores, Holmes. That's fucking crazy, bro. She got more elves than Santa. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she got a toy factory, Carda. Uh, she got damn. these little motherfuckers at a sweatshop. She was like, we represent the lollipop kid, the lollipop kid. <laughs> hey, bro, like that shit just, because where she lived, there was this hill that me and my homies used to go and blaze. Uh-huh. We used to go and blaze there, homie. And one time, fucking, I was about to bone a chick there. And the yeah. cops just rolled up on us. Wait fool. a minute. Were you in a vehicle? In a vehicle. Yeah. Yeah, dude. My pito was already out. Wait a minute. You and your homie and a girl. The hill was right there. And if you look over, you can see the Circle K. <laughs> no, no, but your homeboy and you were going to tag team her? Nah, I was going to bone her by myself. Yeah, because you're greedy. Yeah, I'm greedy like that. Fuck, that's it. What's all the diseases? Hey, but, <laughs> but anyway, that's what we see. I want to be the fucking thief, Holmes. Yeah, you disease thief. The thief at the night. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but but one time, dude, fucking some cholos fucking ran up on us up there, homie. Wait a minute, how did some cholos run up on you? Cause me and my homie were fucking blazing with yeah. some high knife. Yeah. And these cholos roll up with fucking. It was a it was a dude and a girl, and they block us in both ways. Cause there was a one way fucking little road to get yeah. up to that hill, and they block us in, and they pull up. They have their cuetes. They're like, "Hey, bro, like give us all your money, like fool. We're fucking broke, dude." Yeah, like, we ain't got shit. He's like, give us all your weed. Like, fool, we just got this fucking roach left. Yeah, can we smoke it together? <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> you ain't taking my last joint. You gotta <laughs> fucking kill me for were that shit. shit oh, they were talking shit, dude. But uh, in all honesty, dude, me and my homie were shitting our pants, homie. Well, of course. They had quit. When we saw the guns come out, dude. Yeah. We're like, fuck, dude, cooperate and listen, homie. <laughs> yeah. He's, He's like, like give me all your money. Backwards. I was like, dude, I don't got no. I pulled out my wallet. Like, fool, uh, I ain't got you shit. You showed him your fucking bank statement bank and shit. Bank statement everything, fool. I don't give him a debit card. Well, your fucking that's, 401k. <laughs> this motherfucker. Fuck that. I would have dropped. Act like I was dead, homie. <laughs> fuck <laughs> that <laughs> shit. Hey, I, I ain't going through. I ain't talking to the dude. I ain't showing him shit. Hey, I'm dropping to the floor, and I'm acting like I'm fucking dead, dude. Hey, fucking Tolo fool. pulled out his fuck fucking W-2 form and shit. Yeah, he was like, hey, fool. check it out, man. I gave him my car fax and everything, <laughs> homes. You're fucking, fuck uh, that. that's crazy, bro. Do you guys ever almost, hey, dude. you guys almost been robbed at gunpoint? or Dude, like I shit, said, bro, I had I'm dropping, and I'm acting fool. like I'm fucking dead. I got shot. I got killed. Oh, I don't give a fuck. I'm not breathing for that fucking whole fucking robbery, dude. Yeah. yeah. I'm dropping like I'm dead. I don't give a fuck. It is scary, dude. <laughs> hey, so you, oh, you're going to play possum? Possum, bro. Said, fuck it. You got to. It's hey, like a fucking bear. Bear comes at you. You better act dead, homie. Oh, fuck yeah. I'm going to fucking eat you. You better do something because a bear's going to fuck you. Bro, it's funny you said that because I didn't real. You know what I always used to think to myself? Okay. Yeah. I used to think to myself, if I ever get chased by a bear... I'll just climb a tree, right? What the Bro, fuck? Bro, have you ever seen a bear climb a tree? Fuck yeah, they're fast. In seconds, like a, two seconds are on top of the, the tallest tree in the world, yeah, bro. Because they fuck, it takes like three strides. Yeah, and they're just up there. Mm-hmm. This, you, you'll be breakfast. Oh, you'll yeah. Breakfast. E- easy, easy. And I saw a video on YouTube of these fucking guys that are in a tree. 
and they're just looking at like they're filming the bears down there and then one of them just climbs the tree and he's right next to one of them and he's like oh shit he's right next to you oh shit he's right next to you and the bears just like doesn't know the vatos on this side of the tree and the bears just holding on looking around like what's going on in here I thought somebody was up here podcasting, and then he just got back down like nothing. I was like, wait a minute. Oh, he got down? He got I saved? was like. He, they didn't need his ass? They didn't need his ass, but I was thinking, that bear got up there so fucking fast. Like, you couldn't even you couldn't even react to how fast this fucking bear got up there, bro. That bear would have fucked you up. You know hey, what I mean? Fool, a bear's going to fuck me up regardless. Yeah, dude. a bear's going to fuck you up I'm regardless. Dude, yeah. If I'm near a bear, I'm fucked. Yeah. I'm fucked. If that fool attacks me, I'm fucked. <laughs> Yeah. I'm going to cry like a little bitch. Drop dead. Drop dead. That's what hey, he's going to say. But did they put the guns at you, Tolo? Hey, you know, hey, you know one thing about bears? Let's say a cougar or a lion gets you, they're going to kill you instantly. Yeah. But a bear's going to have fun with your ass. He eats you from your asshole first. A bear, a bear eats you from your asshole first. What the? Think about that. He's eating your asshole first. You're fucking dying, bro, while he's eating you. Wait a minute, bro. I never had my asshole eaten, so that's kind of like no, a I'm just plus. joking. No, they... Nah, I was gonna say that's a freaky fucking bear. (laughs) Start from the ass. Hey, hey, I see. I did see a video on fucking YouTube. It's these like it's like a lion. It's like these lions eating a fucking a zebra or something. I swear to God, in the little cub. Yeah. He goes like (laughs) that. Fuck goes from behind, and he gets stuck in the fucking zebra's asshole, bro. And he's just for a long time, bro. No, he's trying to get out. Who's Cause, that? Cause his fucking face goes in there, bro. And Who's he can't get out. Yeah, he can't get out for a long time. Does he the... die? Nah, he finally does make what it is out. What that? I think it was a lion or cougar, something that something that eats fucking cheetahs or um. I think and it was, he got stuck it in was his a asshole. Zoo. Yeah, he got stuck in his asshole, dude. What the fuck? I've seen a lot of crazy. Hey, shit. Hey, wild life is crazy, bro. Wild life is yeah. fucking crazy. Yeah. I've seen elephants stick their trunks in other elephants' asses. If shit, somebody bro. asks you right now, what's the craziest thing you've ever seen in your life? Like in real life? Yeah, what is it? See, that's hard to think of, huh? Yeah. Hell no. What's yours? Oh, dude. The the the, what the craziest you, thing craziest? you've ever seen in your life. Like Did with I your own eyes. See, see, that's hard, bro. Because well, so we see so much crazy hard, shit. No, <laughs> no but you know, the craziest shit I've seen was two Whoppers for, for five dollars mix and match <laughs> a water burger. I think the, the craziest wop- I ever saw was the Big Mac shrinking on me. <laughs> that motherfucker, when I was a kid, that motherfucker was huge. <laughs> now, that motherfucker's small. Yeah. Fuck yeah. that, dude. The Big Mac shrinking, that was my biggest, craziest thing I ever saw <laughs> in my fucking life. If you think about it. <laughs> McDonald's, thank you. Oh. Think you're fucking up my burger. Mm-hmm. You guys ever worked at McDonald's? Oh, hey, man. I never worked there. I never worked at a fast food joint. I worked Have at you? Capital McDonald's. That motherfucker was packed with motherfuckers. Where's that? Where at? It was on uh, 19th and Van Buren. Van, fucking Van Buren, you know. 19th Avenue Van Buren? Dude, you is, don't even want to know. Is, what's all the minute? craziness, all the fucking there, is craziness. It still there? Hey, wait a minute, bro. No, it's not there no more. They made it to a restaurant. Oh, it made it made it to a canasta. Yeah, it's a canasta now. Hey, you worked at that McDonald's? A long time ago when it was crazy. Yeah, that place was thugged hey, out back then. Thugged out. It was out. thugged out back then. Crazy bro. shit went down at that McDonald's. Man, I used to have a dude that worked there. He's like, man, I think I'm gonna go to Rio. Like, what? Then you need to go to the doctor, motherfucker. Yeah, Why you yeah. telling me? Don't fool. be making me burn. Yeah, don't, touch, yeah. don't touch my fries, puto. <laughs> And then what else happened? They're like, you had customers Fuck, going in there all fucking oh, crazy. Oh, man. This dude was fucking some bitch in the restroom. And then we had her like, what the fuck? This, oh, man, I got to get fired. Everybody had to get fired, bro. Who got oh, fired? Oh, one of the workers was fucking. Oh, yeah. Yeah, dude. It was it's too were intense. People, were people getting high And there? that was at night. That was at night. Were people that getting high door, there? That door was open till like 11, bro. Yeah. Back in the days, doors were open till 11. And yeah. then there was drive through nation and, after. And, 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 dude, it's not even that. It's Van Buren, bro. Yeah, it's Van Buren. You know Hookers, what I mean? Hookers, pimps, that was, drugs. No, that was, that's when crack was really hitting the streets. Yeah. Crack was hitting the streets at that time. Yeah. It's too crazy. It's too much. Hey, did too it? Much How long did you work there for? Man, I was there for a while, but fuck that. I had to quit, dude. I couldn't be manager. Yeah. It tells you how long I've been working there. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I had a, hey, when they sold it, he was in there doing the drywall and shit for the new restaurant. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, the rewiring and shit. Hey, what do you want, that comal, mija? We're going to put it over here nah, in this area. But, so nah. you guys are calling this La Canasta? But fast food, yeah. hey, fast food, 
It's 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 fun and it's crazy when you're young. Yeah, I think it's one of those things where you should do it when you're young. It's an experience. You're yeah, saying, yeah. You're, you're it's saying, like your first job. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, oh, it's my first job. I'm really gonna get a check. Did that McDonald's yeah. ever get robbed? Where you get where you were there? Oh uh, no, I never got robbed. Never got robbed. But did everybody there get high? Shit. Everybody got high, but that's when. We wasn't as legal as now, you know what I mean? Yeah. Back Yo, in shit. the day, you get caught. You were fucked. Oh, man. You're fucked. Yeah. Especially in this fucking state, huh? Mm-hmm. You got to understand, Arizona is a non-tolerant state. Yeah, zero, zero tolerance. Zero tolerance here. So, everybody out there doing your thing, remember. Don't come to don't this cry. Shit, hey, I got a question, Tolo. What up? Do your time. When you were getting robbed by those cholos, did they point the gun at you? Or they just pulled them out. How many cholos was no, it? No, they just they, they didn't. It's Choloville. No, the the vato just fucking showed the fucking top of it. It could have been fake, but I don't. At that moment, you don't give a fuck. Yeah. Where were you, dude? Lake Elsinore. Oh, yeah. all California. Right, all right. Mm-hmm. So they're rolling deep over there, or what? That's fake little fucking cholos. You know what I mean? And then what? They wouldn't last a day over here, homie. So then what happened? Nothing, bro. We just fucking, like, fucking bounce all scared. Like, fuck, that was scary, Holmes. You know what I mean? Yeah. Take me home. I want to go home. Was that family. girl talking shit, too? The cholo? Yeah, fuck yeah. She was the, probably more aggressive than that, yeah, though. She yeah. Was, oh, she was way scarier than that fool. Yeah, she was yeah, ready way, to fucking bust I'm a cap this, in your yeah, fucking I'm ass. Yeah, this bitch will shoot you, fool. Yeah, girls this are bitch nuts, will shoot bro. you. Fuck yeah. What so. was she saying? Like, hurry the fuck up. <laughs> give, give us the fatty. Yeah, well, we don't have shit. Like, fuck it. We got a roach, bitch. Like, fuck. Yeah. Well, we weren't be, we were being that aggressive. We were being actually cordial and nice. Like, no. Like, <laughs> you guys were all like, well, oh, I just got hired at the. Uh, uh, this is our last bit. At of Hastings Mar- and Hastings. This is our last bit of marijuana we got left. Uh, uh, this maybe is, uh, you could take uh, the rest, uh, please. Will you take the rest of it with you? Man? Will yeah, you validate dude. my parking? Yeah, it was scary, it? fool. You could say you'll fucking wild out, but when you got quite this pointed at you, yeah. it's kind of. Hey, it's kind of like a di- drop dead and act dead on. A bl- <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah. Hey, a block, a cop fucking pull, dead, a homie. cop pulled his gun out on me before. That was pretty scary. Why did he pull it out on you? It was fucking. We're on a. It was New Year's Eve, two thousand four. So it was gonna be two thousand five at midnight. Yeah. So we had like fucking enough for like three blunts. Yeah. And it was midnight. It was about to be midnight. So I like, hey, let's go to fucking Terracotta Park and go blaze these fucking three blunts. We picked up some fucking honey dips and we dipped yeah. up there and we're fucking hot boxing, bro. A cop fucking just comes and parks his car right in front of my fool with his lights on. And what happened? And, oh, everybody gets scared. Yeah. And I was like, hey, just chill, guys. Let me talk to him. So I opened the door and I got out and the black guy fucking gets off and he starts talking to me. So I, the door's just all oh, kinds of smoke coming now. He's like, <laughs> he, I started doing these were his words. He's like, He's like, uh, this reminds me of a Cheech and Chong movie. He's like, uh, I'm getting high just standing here. That's the what fucking he said? cop told Are you serious? Yeah, the cop What kind of car were you in? I was in the... In the, the Rolls in the, Royce? No, I was in the Pontiac, <laughs> on the Pontiac Grand Am that we used to have, that silver one. Yeah. Oh, all right, all right. Yeah, we are in that fucking Was it a whip. six-cylinder? So he goes, fuck it. Uh, do you have any more weed in there? I'm like, nah, dude. We fucking just fucking hot box this bitch with three blunts to bring in the New Year. Like that? <laughs> No, I swear. And then I, I put my and hands. It was New Year's Eve. I put my hands in my pocket. It was New Year's Eve. New or Year's, New New Year's Eve. Okay, oh. it was fucking freezing. I still remember. I had my Dickies jacket on, and I put my hands in my pocket. And that fool goes like this, sir. Don't put your hands in your pocket. I'm all right. I'm sorry. And I forgot. You know, I'm fucking stoned. It's fucking cold. And I do it again. This fool just pulls out his sweat. There, sir. You do that one more time. You're gonna force me to shoot. I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. I got scared, bro. I'm like, I don't got shit, bro. You can fucking check yeah. me, carnal. I want to let the audience know that Tolo's hands are in the air right now. In the air, speak. yeah. And I was just like, fuck, yes, sir, that's scary. So then he goes, all right, guys, everybody get out the car. <laughs> yeah. And one of the high nuts had the smallest skirt you've ever seen in your life. Fuck. And when she was about to get out, her whole fucking culo, her panocha just fucking points at the cop's face. And what does he say? And saying? he goes, hey, it's okay, guys. Just fucking stay in the car. I already knew why this fool didn't want to fucking get more horneado than fucking yeah. that. That's all of you he needed for the day. Yeah. So he goes, all right, guys, fucking you guys drive home safe and have a happy new year, carnal. So did you guys smash? Nah, fuck no. We went fuck, home. Bro, your stories get good and they go downhill real quick. Always, bro. fool. The climax fuck. sucks. <laughs> and I was like, God damn. This fool's bro. got laid. This fool's bone. These fucking cops. Nope. 
Yeah, like, what happened? Hey, one home. time I'm walking down the street. Check this out, bro. Damn. My homeboy, this is broad daylight. We're going to fucking go back to this story. I'm going to tell the story, but then we're going to go back. Okay. Go for it. So me and my homeboy go this walking was like down. Qu- this was like the hey, Quentin Tarantino story. Dude. Yeah, so we're jumping everywhere. What happened to the fucking gonorrhea story? Oh, that yeah. was over a long that time ago. That was over a long time oh, ago. Go okay. for it, I said. So I'm walking down Central with my homeboy, and it's broad daylight. <laughs> and we're just walking, and we just start fucking writing graffiti allegedly on this fucking building, right? Destroying state Destroying. property. <laughs> Say it right. Say it right, please. You're destroying state property. Uh, he's like, you know that's illegal. You're breaking According the law. According to section 247-93. Pino. <laughs> so we end up walking and we're doing this shit in you know, Central Avenue allegedly. And we see this fucking Monte Carlo pass us. Was that yesterday? Nuh-uh. So we watch this Monte Carlo pass us. And then the guy busts a U-turn. Yeah. What year is this? This was... You said Monte Carlo. I'm like... Yeah. Um, if I were to guess, like, 94. Okay? So we're walking. This guy busts... He passes us on Central. He busts a U-turn. And I told my homeboy, Hey, you see that vato just busts a U-turn? Because you could tell the windows were both rolled down here with a cholo. And he's like, yeah. So then he passes us now, going south. And then he busts a young, another U-turn. And I go, hey, that vato just busted another U-turn. So now he's going to roll up next to us. And he did. And he pulls out a cuete and he's pointing it at both of us. And he's like, hey, where the fuck you put those from? Like, this fool's, this fool's ready to blast, bro. We're just, like, frozen. Like, uh. But, like, for nowhere, he's like, what that shit you're writing on the fucking wall? I said, where the fuck are you guys from? What neighborhood? And we're like, N- we didn't write anything. He's like, we saw you. He said, I saw you, motherfuckers, so. He ended up, we're like, well, now we're going to bang. You know what I mean? We just right. Homie. Yeah, so. I was writing we're a taggers. poem. Yeah, so he you took. You guys were taggers. Yeah, we were tagging. Yeah, so but, he like, takes, but Cholos hate taggers. Yeah, Cholos yeah. hate taggers and taggers hate Cholos. Taggers are just destroying state property. <laughs> hey, go stay going to let it go. He's yeah. like, so at the moral of the story is you guys were allegedly so destroying. Taxpayers. At the end of the day, Cholos were doing the right thing by getting rid of your taggers. <laughs> Talk about were, cleaning up the street. <laughs> You're so, doing a purge. So check this out. Till this day, and I hope the person that was with me is listening to this podcast because he listens to it off and on. Okay. Till this fucking day, if you were if we were standing around just talking, having beers, we weren't even podcasting. This is him. Hey, Chori, so remember that time I almost got shot? Fool, tell this fool that story when I almost got that cholo almost fucking blew me away. Oh, and that's a story right yeah, there. Yeah, that's a story. And I'm always like, bro. It was both of us. It was both of us, you piece of shit. You know what I mean? But to him, after all these years, no matter what. It was him. People even will come up to me. Hey, is it true that when you and this fool were down, he almost got shot on Central, bro? What were you doing with this vato almost got shot? Fool, you weren't backing him up. I'm I almost like, got shot too, fool. Yeah, I was like, what the? What story is he telling everybody? Damn, he should he should Dude, come on the podcast. I, I, I want to hear his side of the story. Yeah, we're gonna call that motherfucker fairy tale. Chorizo so fucking ran. He fucking <laughs> yeah. hit in the butt in the in the state hey, bus. Fucking Chorizo played possum. That motherfucker hit the floor. And oh fucking shit! Convulsing and shit. But just play possum, right? Fucking ghost. Man, ghost is cold as fuck, huh? I'm hey. cold, high, drunk. That's hey, good. Hey, ghost. hey, ghost, if you want, bro, I got a brand new fucking beanie that's never been worn, bro. You want it, homie? It's at my house. You want it? Yeah. Yeah, why not? Okay, sure. then. Hey, Are I'll you? be back tomorrow, fool. Hell yeah, you we'll better be bring that shit. I'll be back tomorrow. Shit. Chapter 2 coming out. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody better catch it. Ghost, hey. Ghost is ready. Ghost, Ghost yeah. should have sat next to the Bernie Log over here. Fuck yeah, we need fucking Fuck, more firewood. Dude, that that fire is I gone. feel like I'm in Alaska. Uh-huh. Where's the bitch with the ice? <laughs> hey, fool, this fucking weather's ice been crazy. Yes, sir. Yeah. yeah uh, 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 it's hot. It's cold. It's fucking rainy. It, it's not. It. Arizona is, is the place to be, man. It's, I love it. I love the weather. And it's, Bill Gates just bought, like, fucking 80 man, acres building, in Buckeye. Know, he did? Yeah. Like he's smart What's he doing? He's going like he, to build. He's gonna build the first smart city in the fucking smart world. City. Is that what he oh, said? Smart yeah, he already did it. He already bought the fucking land. He oh, bought like 800 that, acres man, or some shit, dude. I believe in this Smartville. For all you dumb motherfuckers so move, can't get in. Guess where I'm moving to? Man, I'm moving know. to Buckeye. Hey, that, I'm going to go get me a land next to Smartville. Bro, if you get a house in Buckeye, the fucking property is going to shoot through the fucking Hey, no joke. No joke. He bought. He bought Smartville. Yeah, Smartville. No joke. Yeah. Smartville. Everything's going to be smart. Everything. The tiendas. The fucking 
the buildings, the carros. And you can live there. And you can live there. And you don't gotta be smart. No. He's got a lot of money. They only want fucking dumbasses living there. Like they give you IQ test. Fucking Bill Gates bought a fucking property in AZ. To build the first smart city in the United States. And, and, and what did he pick? AZ. He's, yeah, Buckeye. The city of Buckeye. Home. Well, cause, yeah. Dude, they don't got forest over there. Well, it's, there's nothing there yet. So he's he's going to yeah, pop. Oh, man. Oh, that's going to be the most popular fucking place in the world. That's it. Everybody's going to want to come here. Fucking goofy. Nah, <laughs> yeah. Man. If you're a nerd, you're going to get all kinds of fucking pine. Man. Fuck yeah. So that means that more money. <laughs> Donuts. More money. All kinds of shit, homes. <laughs> Barranitos, all kinds all of kinds shit. All kinds of shit, Holmes. Hey, that's fucking insanity, bro. You finished both of them, Holmes? Man. You want another one? Hey, Ghost, did you finish both of those? Oh, Here, Ghost. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, Damn, yeah, yeah. Ghost Give polished those motherfuckers off like a gangster, He, he bro. did, fool. Ghost could drink. Man, yes, Modelo's, Modelo's, uh, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. Well, yeah, those Michelada, they don't, <laughs> they don't taste like these yeah. fucking orange blossoms. Dude. Hey, those fucking enchiladas are good, bro. Hey, those orange blossoms taste like... I don't like know what you guys are drinking, but... The pit of fucking... I don't like that can. It's... it's, it's that's... Yeah. Never buy orange and brown can, I guess. Yeah. They're, they're, hey. It's not right. We've learned our lesson. Shit, because I'm hungry ghost. like a wolf. It's it. Hey, Ghost, we've learned our lesson, carnal. Not to buy brown cans. Don't buy brown cans. Hey, so fucking... That's crazy, so, though. I didn't know Bill Gates did that. It's because I don't watch the news. So, AZ Life was Whoa. crazy back in the day? Like, cholos were popping up like that, or what? Yeah. That wasn't the only time, bro. I've had motherfuckers put... I wonder if put... they're going to have Cholos in Smartville. Oh, shit. <laughs> like a smart Cholo? A smart Cholo, dude. Uh, he walks up. What's up, man? His you lungs. know what two plus two is? <laughs> <laughs> Where you from, home? Hey, I'm Where from you fuck... from? Hey, what's up with that blue tablet? That's it. Don't hey. get fucked up, bro. They're all tagging E equals hey, MC home. squared, home. I got the new iPhone, motherfucker. <laughs> 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 you want me to jump you in? You better bring me ten Xboxes. And ten you want to get? Hey, what's your password? Is this hey, so Holmes, we can jump you in? Hey, Holmes, you want you want to get jumped in, Holmes? You better, you, you better break this code, carnal. Uh, you better set up an account, puto. <laughs> if you want to get jumped in, the clica. You want to be in my clica? You better fucking hack this password, eh? <laughs> hey, motherfucker! You want to be in my gang? You'll be split an atom, an atom, motherfucker. <laughs> Right now, hey Holmes, you want me? My, you want me for my game, Holmes? You know how to work the Bunsen burner, eh? <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's up, Pesce? Stop breaking, breaking beakers, eh? Say, won't you break all that on this, Holmes? <laughs> Shit, you want to be my fucking homie? <laughs> you want to make me some? <laughs> Give me some fucking super ecstasy, motherfucker. Give me my bubble love. Smart that, motherfucker. Smart city, my ass. Give me my money city. Oh my god. Oh shit! Oh shit, bro! Oh, That's fuck. a good one, man. Dude, you want to be for my gang, Holmes? You better oh. learn how to fucking. You better learn how to use this fucking segway if you want to be for my body. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker! Hey. You want to be for my gang? You hey. better have a they fucking. They have a segway tablet. car show. Hey, and you want those all segways on fucking twenty twos and shit? Hey, you want to be for my barrio, homie? You better learn how to fucking sync them Bluetooth in less than fifteen seconds, eh? <laughs> yeah. Fuck yeah, girl! Hey, what's what's your number, mija? Are you a fucking eight gigabyte or a five? Hey, what's... hey, Mija, what's your social media, Mija? <laughs> hey, Mija, what's your dot com, Mija? What's your dot com, Mija? Hey, Trying to Mi- get you, girl. You up. Hey, Mija, I saw your Wikipedia, Mija. You're looking fit, man. Uh, uh, I give you a fucking five star <laughs> Yelp review. Get me, girl. <laughs> like, damn, Mija. <laughs> Yeah, man, Smart City. Is that what he's going to call it? Smart City. Smart City, fool. Man. Did he say that? Yup, and that's where the first Smart Cholos ever yeah, are going to come smart out. Smart Cholos, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can't wait. Can't, Can't wait. wait. Hey, there's not enough Cholos in this world. They're all dying there's not, out, fool. Bro. Rambo won't shut the fuck up. Shut hey, up, Rambo. I seen a Cholo when I was at Jack in the Box the other day, fool. Did you really? He works at the drive-thru. For real? I was like, hey, fool. Did he have a teardrop? Nah, he was just like. Hey, these, these tacos ain't carne asada, fool. I don't know if you really want them. And I was like, well, they're two for a dollar, bro. Like, fucking throw them in a bag, is it? And he was like, pues, 
The Come show. to the window, homes, because I got to know what you look like. Yeah, but do you, you. but do you see? Are you notice that cholos are real fucking polite, though? Well, like, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Not, like you know why? Because you know? they, they've been to court so much, they know the fucking they, they know the, the right way to talk and shit. It's, uh, they They're want something, they gotta, nice, nice. they gotta be nice. They gotta be nice. You know what I mean? It's like, you know what I mean? You pull up to, like he said, you pull up and, like, hey, uh, there are court. Can, they're I, can, court. I, can w- I get a hammer? Yeah, you can have my hamburger. <laughs> like they're all cool about it. Like they're all right, sir. back. Hey, can I get some extra cheese? Uh, yeah, man. You can get some extra cheese. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? they, re- they repeat the whole menu to you. You know, so man. Yeah. yeah. No, that's true though. Like Tolos are real polite, dude. They're, they're kind to old, except to their fuck. If they see a fucking rival though. Oh yeah, they they become the devil, homes. <laughs> Yeah, They'll bro. shoot up anybody in sight, yeah. homie, as long as they get to that vato. Hell yeah. Like, hey, this fool was polite, homes. Yeah, but he just shot a fucking Hell three-year-old, homes. Yeah, it don't my... matter. He was so Man, nice. he wanted extra cheese, and I said no. Yeah, fuck that vato, bro. Fuck that vato. Let me come in through here hopping your fucking round fly. Thinking the fucking cheese is free. Fucking go flake hitting the fucking building and shit. Don't be trying to fuck up my building. They say, I got to fucking work here, homes. You know what I mean? What if I yeah, try to pick a no sign? extra cheese, homes. Yeah, you ain't getting no queso up in this hueso. Oh, oh shit! Yeah. <laughs> that's all no extra queso on this west. Okay, okay. You know I, mean? I like that. That's a fucking. That's what a cholo would say too. Yeah, though. they like to rhyme, bro. Yeah, I was you gonna ever say, hey, you ever talk to a cholo? They a cholo rhyme. Cholo rhyme bro. Always rhymes. You know what I mean? Always rhymes. Que pasa calabaza? <laughs> you know what <laughs> I mean? Shit like that. They're always rhyming, dude. Una <laughs> cara de torta. <laughs> You're like, what, yeah, the, what the fuck? Cara they shouldn't even rhyme. I'll see you later, alligator. Even the rhymes don't even rhyme, homes. Hey, dude. Some rhymes don't. Even right, no, like, you want a pendejo. You know what I mean? Like, you want a pendejo, like, yeah, it's so stupid, like, hell yeah, like, hey, you know what time it is, puto? You know what I mean? Like, dude, cholos do have fucking the way to talk. Because yeah. people are always scared of them. Yeah, yeah especially dude. little kids. As oh, a little yeah. kid, I was scared of cholos, fool. Yeah, I was oh, a, shit, I, I better respect this vato homes. Yeah, and then I hate when they're like, my hair fire. My hefa, my hefa, my hefa. God like, damn, hey, dude! You're kind of like making a start like my hefa. You know what? The cholos always expect you to be like a jefita, psychic. Jefita, jefita. They come at you like this. They like want their jefita, like this, yeah. like a little tiny midget yeah. fucking. Yeah. <laughs> hey, get your ass to work, you little fucker. I'm like, these fucking cholos want you to be a psychic because they're like, man, guess what? I fucking just, hate my jefe. Hey, guess what just happened to me? <laughs> guess what oh, just, my, my work jefe. Hey, guess what oh, just happened, bro. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. uh, like that's what I mean. Like, why would you call your dad your jefe? Like, you have to hate your jefe. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Don't you hate your fucking jefe at work? He's always a bitch. Hey, my jefe is a pretty good guy. All right. No, Chorizo. No, he's a piece of shit. <laughs> Chorizo still on the clock. Hey, sorry hey, sorry hey, for hey. putting you on the spot, Chorizo. Check this no, he bro. You can put me on the raise. spot all you want, bro. We keep it real like a two dollar. Yeah, dude. I, I've fucking. never met a hefe I get along with, hey, dog. Hey, I I'm, I met a few hefes that I get a schlong with. Yeah, but not along with. Hey, we don't get along with you, mijo. Yeah, why do you call your hefe? Why do the gangsters call their hefes that? I don't know. That's weird. That's they just it. do. But you know, my you bo- could- you're not my boss. Yeah. Oh, yes, I, I met am, a puto. cholo. I made you, puto. I met a cholo at the hospital. You he was some... a RN. For real? He was a registered nurse. He was a cholo, though. He was like, hey, this vato in this bed's going to die. He said, so we're going to get a room ready for you in a little bit. I was like, what happened to him? He's like, mind your own fucking business, ese. I'm just letting you know the vato's going to check out and you're going to check in. Orale. I was like, all right, bro. <laughs> that fool was yeah. super polite. Yeah, he was real nice, bro. Like, I didn't know whether to shake his hand or kiss it. You but know check this mean? out, chorizo. Huh? I want to have Brother Ghost sign us out mm-hmm. with a nice prayer. How's that sound, Brother Ghost? You Man, th- let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do yeah, it. Right. This for everybody out there listening to the Roach Clip. To RoachClip.com. We got it going on. Keep it hearing. Keep it hollering. Keep it simple. Keep it real dimple. Because we're all here just hearing the podcast of Roach Clip. This, this is Tolo and Chorizo. This is the Roach Clip podcast. And all you guys can go fuck yourselves. And we're out, bitches.